Thank you so much, Hannah. We sure do appreciate that. And now I know you guys, this is what we're all waiting for. We're waiting for these anglers to roll on through here and get this weigh-in started. Let's hear it for my weighmaster and partner in crime. Welcome to the stage, Mr. Glenn Kale. Man, weights are stacked. It's tight. Just like Lake Hartwell should be in the fall. It's uh, today's moving day. What do we think? I like it exactly where it's at because the what's going to happen is the cream rises to the top. That's what these college coaches tell me, man. The best of the best is here. The cream rises to the top. And I'm telling you right now, it's moving day, and somebody's going to sit in that seat today, and they're going to take home that trophy right there, and it's going to change the world. They're going to take home some money, spend some money on mama or maybe their girlfriend, maybe both. I don't know. Hopefully it ain't like that. But I'm just going to tell you. <laughs> Y'all were listening. Real quick, thanks to the youth directors. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Thanks for all your support. I appreciate you. Great meeting this morning. Let's make 2024 the best that we can make it be. Thank you so much, brother. Thank you, Glenn. Do you think these guys are ready? I mean, does this sound like Death Valley? No, nowhere near it, man. This, this, this crowd, the folks back at home, you don't have a clue. This place is packed with the best fans in the country right here. The best sport. This is a family-oriented sport, whether it's your husband, your boyfriend, whatever you're here supporting, your son. Let's get loud. I'm going to weigh this towel, man. I have to do this for the kids, but we got to get loud. Can we get loud? We going to, can we do it one time? All right. Let's get this first angler up here. And when you, when we do, you got to get really loud for me. Representing the PVA, Paralyzed Veterans of America, bringing us one more fish today. Come on up, Mr. Jack Barber. Jack's bringing us one today, one today out there on Lake Hartwell. Jack, good to see you today, man. Good to see you. Come on right here. Get a weight on this one for you. How about 13 ounces, 13 ounces for you? I know you got a few people you'd love to say hello and thank you to. I do. Um, fishing, fishing was tough today. I mean, I had fish on, uh, get out from the boat and fish jump, and here comes the bait and no fish. I, uh, it was tough. Uh, but I did catch the fish. I just couldn't get them to the boat. Uh, a little bit about Paralyzed Veterans of America. Uh, we've been around... Uh, for 30 years on the on the PVA bass tour, uh, we help disabled veterans and also people with disabilities in our bass tour. We have seven stops around the United States, uh, and it stays pretty busy. Uh, we've been uh, around for 75 years. We have over 16,000 members. It's a pleasure to be working with bass. And honored to be here and the PVA, and it just give me a pleasure to be here. Well, thank you, Jack. And the honor is all ours. The honor is all ours, Mr. Jack. Let's hear it for Mr. Jack Barber and the PVA, Paralyzed Veterans of America. Thank you, Jack. We sure do love having you here. Jack, next up. Coming on up here. Rolling out of Texas. James Seymour. Mr. James rode around with Chris Moody today. James bringing us five today. Five for James Seymour out of Texas. Started the day. With four pounds and five ounces. Four or five for you yesterday, James. Four or five yesterday. Five more for us today. 
about six pounds and 14 ounces. 614 for you, James, all the way up to third place. You want to hold up a couple? Man, great, solid event for you here this week at Lake Hartwell. It was rough. It was pretty rough, actually. So I um, was blessed to be here and blessed to uh, make it this far. Uh, got one regional and came here, and it was amazing and had a good time. Everyone's good. The people are good. South Carolina's good. And thanks my wife for letting me go fishing. Well, James, thank you, and great job, man. What an accomplishment being here on the Bass Nation stage. Next up, on the boater side, out of Georgia, weighed in 14 pounds and three ounces yesterday. Chris Moody bringing us five more today. 14-3 yesterday, Chris. Looks like a little bit tougher day for you here today. Much tougher bite today. They just my fish. I don't know if they left or if they repositioned or they didn't like what I was throwing. So try to make some last minute adjustments and it just didn't happen. So, but enjoyed this event. Thank you for everybody for coming out. Wanted to say hey to my wife Kelly, my three kids, uh, Molly, Tyler, and River. Thank y'all for watching. I want to thank Peachtree City Bass Anglers and Georgia Bass Nation. We'll have about six pounds seven ounces for you today. That's gonna bring you to twenty pounds and ten ounces. Currently in first place right now on the boater side. Long way in to go. Let's keep it coming. Out of Iowa. 88 years old. Jerry Dunkley. Jerry rode with Jordan Card today. Hey, sit down, Jerry. Jerry Dunkley. Look at that. Surprise a chicken. Spring chicken, right? Oh, yes. I'm uh, 88 years young. <laughs> that's right. That's right, Jerry. Tough event for you this week. No fish again today, but, man, how cool is it and how special it is. How special is it to be here on this stage? How special it is for me, I tell you. I really appreciate you guys, what you do in these tournaments. And I've been a member of Bass for 41 years, and I finally made it. Well, Jerry, I'm glad it was with me, man, and I'm so glad to get to see you, man. Thank you, Jerry. Good luck, man. We sure do appreciate you. Next up, out of Tennessee, bringing us five today. Started the day with 11 pounds and an ounce. Bringing us five more, Jordan Card. 11-1 to start the day. Nine pounds, two ounces for Jordan Card. Got him all the way up to second place. Second place currently. Going to hold a couple of these up. Nine, two for Jordan Card today. Bringing his two-day total to 20 pounds and three ounces. 20 pounds and three ounces. Jordan, 11-1 yesterday. I know you were looking for one more big bite again today, just like you kind of were yesterday. But uh, look, probably going to be a solid event. We'll see how things shake out, of course, a long way in to go. Well, I mean, first of all, I mean, that was very inspirational just fishing with Jerry. I mean, just to see him out there. I mean, I, I even told him, I was like, you're an inspiration to me. But as far as the fishing goes, I mean, I, I really wanted the wind, and today it blew. And I actually had the bites, but I, I just didn't execute. I didn't put them in the boat. So I, I missed three or four big ones. But you know, that's fishing, but I want to say hi to my family. They came out. I appreciate them, and uh, I want to say thanks to the Tennessee uh, Bass Nation and, and, and Bass Nation. Well, Jordan, we sure do appreciate you, man. It's been a pleasure getting to know you over the last few months. Thank you, Jordan. Come on up, boat number 55, boat 55. Non-boater out of Oregon. Dave Roberts. 
Dave's got us three today. Dave Roberts bringing us three today. Had a really good start to his tournament yesterday, bringing us eight pounds and six ounces, eight pounds and six ounces. Three more to go with that today. Two pounds and two ounces, two, two, 11, two, 11, two. Two-day total for you, Dave, 11, two, two-day total. Yeah, it was a tough day out there today. It just needed five more good bites to really get me in this thing. Uh, but it didn't happen. I uh, just wanted to say... Thanks to my wife. She's my uh, number one fan. She's out there somewhere, but without her support, couldn't make this happen. That's the reason I'm here. So appreciate you guys, too. Well, thank you, Dave. Hey, and uh, don't go anywhere. Sitting, you know, you're sitting in fourth right now, so we'll see. how. I know it's a long way in, but we'll see how it shakes out for you. Next up, on the boater side, had the loudest cheering section yesterday, Lucas Matt. Lucas bringing us five today, five today out of New York right here in the middle. Lucas Matt out of New York, 5-2 yesterday. A little bit better day for you today, it looks like, Lucas. Six pounds, nine ounces, six pounds, nine ounces for you, Lucas. Tell us a little bit about your week. Uh, it started off pretty hot in practice. I actually caught a one over seven and uh, was thinking that was going to be the deal and uh, went for it. And uh, what happened is uh, the fish dried up and they got tiny. So uh, kind of had to, you know, scrap that plan and went totally different where my dad caught a big one when we went down in August and caught myself a catfish there. So that kind of sums it up. So. Uh, it was a tough week of fishing for me, but caught some spots. It's a lot of fun. Those fish are nuts. You can have them. Uh, they just, they go ballistic. I'll take my smallmouth that are big, and they run. At least they're worth the fight. Well, that sounds good, Luke. Thank you, man, and uh, we sure do appreciate you. How about how about that cheering section? Yeah, it was pretty cool to see them. They surprised me yesterday, and they're still there, and I see little Lola's got a catch a pig sign, so that's pretty cool. Well, Luke, thank you, man. Good luck, man. We sure do look forward to seeing you again. Rolling on up here in these beautiful Toyota trucks. Of course, that's the Tacoma right there. Tyler Gutmiller out of North Dakota. Tyler's bringing us five today. Five today for Tyler Guthmiller. Tyler had a pretty tough day yesterday, but, man, made some adjustments, and it looks like we rebounded today. Oh, yeah, fishing was fish a lot better today. Didn't lose as many. Lost one good one, broke them all. But. Get a weight on these five for you, Tyler. Four pounds, 13 ounces, four pounds, 13 ounces. Go ahead and grab up a couple of those, Tyler. Get you a quick picture. Man, how cool is it represent North Dakota on the non butter side for the very first time? Oh, it's awesome. You know, it's uh, I'm not a very good speaker. I'm kind of nervous, you know, being here first time. So it's it's a good feeling. Well, man, Tyler, we sure do appreciate you, and I look forward to seeing you again. Riding with Tyler, rolling out in fourth place this morning, Andrew Ninover out of South Africa. What's up, Andrew? No, we're doing good. We're doing good. Had another half-decent day, so let's see what the weight is. Uh, I don't think as good as yesterday, but hopefully it keeps us there for tomorrow. How about 14.7? 14.7 coming into today. 11 pounds, 14 ounces. Andrew Nienover all the way up to first place on the boater side. 11 pounds and 14 ounces. Yeah, I, 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 
Andrew, man. 11-14 today, 26 fives, got you sitting in first place, man. Really solid day, a really solid day of backing up what you did yesterday. Yeah, I'm, I'm content with that. It's not quite where I want it to be. I made one crucial error today, which I'm not happy with, but uh, hopefully we make it through and sneak it through tomorrow, and then we can come back with a vengeance. Well, that sounds pretty good to me, Andrew. Go ahead, Andrew, and man, don't don't go anywhere too quick, man. Uh, top ten is going to be we're top ten meeting right here. If you're in the top ten, following the conclusion of this weigh-in, fishing day number three. Next up, out of Arkansas, Jeremiah Prue. Jeremiah. Holding the hands up, that's not thats not a good sign, man. Not a good sign for you. Man, this has been, I've been to Hartwell four times now, and, you know, usually it treats me pretty well, but, man, this time it's absolutely kicked my butt. But, you know, I let too many off get on off yesterday, but today, you know, just didn't have really all the opportunities to get a bag, so, but. Well, man, unfortunately, that's fishing, and uh, Stingy Lake Hartwell, you know, Hitting that fall time, the fish get a little bit finicky, but, uh, man, I know you'll be back. And uh, You're here for the uh, high school national championship back in August, isn't that right? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Hopefully we can make it back to this one next year. we got a state coming up uh, actually next week when I get back home, so we're going to try to qualify for it again. Well, man, that sure sounds good. I'd love to see you there, Jeremiah. Thank you. Jeremiah rode with this guy, rolling out of the Sunshine State, had 10 pounds even yesterday. Welcome me to the stage, Dave Frost. Dave had 10 even yesterday. I don't think I got 15, though. I don't think I got 15. Hopefully, I got about 12. Well, we'll see how they weigh. It looks like you had a decent day. And, man, you know, consistency is the key. And, and not only were you consistent, it looks like you're going to increase your weight maybe a little bit. Hopefully. I only had five bites today and got all of them in the boat. That's all that matters. Well, come on. <laughs> how about 10 pounds, 15 ounces for you, Dave? 10, 15, 20 pounds, 15 ounces. Two-day total, Dave Frost out of Florida. Ten, fifteen, two-day total for Dave. Twenty pounds and fifteen ounces. Twenty pounds and fifteen ounces. Dave said he's gone. He's ready to go back and uh, take a nap. Go ahead, take a nap, rest up. Hopefully, I can fish tomorrow. But if not, well, it's a ride home. <laughs> All right, thank you, Dave. Appreciate you. These next two guys on the non boater side out of Kentucky, Matt Lucan. Matt brought us six pounds and nine ounces coming into today. Bringing us three more, three more for us today, Matt. Going to be a little bit under 6'9", I believe. Yeah, I don't know if we're going to match uh, yesterday's effort, but uh, learned a lot this week, uh, you know, fought through some challenges, and uh, we'll get them better next time. That's right. Three pounds, one ounce, three pounds, one ounce for you, Matt. Anybody you want to say hello or thank you to? Yeah, absolutely. I want to thank my uh, folks for making it in for the weigh-in, uh, Rich Young's wife, Holly, for uh, coming to stay in with us for a week. Uh, she's been a real trooper helping us out. Uh, I want to thank all our friends and family in the KBN back home watching, cheering us on. Uh, they've been nothing nothing but supportive all week. And uh, just want to thank them for tuning in, giving us all the uh, support and love back home. Well, Matt, thank you, man. And we sure do appreciate you fishing with us. Nine pounds, ten ounce, two-day total for you. Nine, ten, two-day total. Thank you. This guy coming out of the Garden State. Out of New Jersey, Manny Cruz. 8-12, coming into today. 8-12, bringing us five more. Five more for you, Manny. It was a grind, but we had a limit early. Just, you know, you got to hit a home run when you're down like this. And uh, I had a big one come up today and just missed the glide bait. And I wanted to go home after that. <laughs> I mean, it, it would have been a game changer. It was one of those. And there's nothing you can do when you miss them like that and they don't get it right. There's nothing you can do. So it was a good time. Uh, this was fun. Um, thank you to you guys and your people for helping us out every morning. I think, you know, 
they need a round of applause. They do a lot. So, Well, how about that? Let's give our volunteers, all of our volunteers and my crew, a huge round of applause, pulling these anglers through, putting them in the water, taking them out of the water, and driving them right here so that you can see these guys weigh in. Thank you, Manny. I sure do appreciate it. And, uh, man, awesome event for you. Well, we tried, you know. Maybe next time. Well, thanks, Manny, dude. Good luck. It was great seeing you at the regional and then again today. Next up, out of Spain, Augustin Pintado Salas. Big sigh for you today. 4-7 yesterday, bringing us a zero today, man. Anybody who wants to say hello or thank you to here back home? Thank you very much. Uh, all people that United States, thank you very much, Jordan. And uh, nothing difficult. Uh, no more. <laughs> well, man, it's so awesome to have you here, man. All the way from Spain. Give him a huge round of applause. Augustin Pintado, thank you. Next up, out of Namibia, Jurgen Geiger, 8 Pounds and five ounces, eight five to start the day. Five more, five more for you. Five little ones. Always great to see you, Jurgen. Get a weight on these. Lively, right? Good live wells in that boat. Man, while we're waiting, anybody wants to say hello or thank you to here back home? I know a lot of people support you and, you know, all the fishing that you do. Yeah, for sure. Um, first of all, I want to start. Thank you, Bass, to give us this opportunity to come from this far. Thank you, America, for making us feel so at home here. It is really, really in, uh, a privilege and an honor. And then, obviously, the wife and kids at home that are sleeping at this moment, uh, I love you and see you soon. Well, Jurgen, thank you, man. I know it takes a ton to make the trip. Eight pounds, three ounces for you today, Jurgen. Two day total, 16.8. 16 8. Next up, non boater out of Missouri. Had six pounds and 10 ounces to start the day. Joe Whelan, Joe Whelan, 16 to start the day, and he's got us four fish, four more. Bringing us four today, Joe. Looking for six pounds, seven ounces, five pounds, eight ounces for you, Joe. Five pounds, eight ounces. Got you sitting in second place on the non-butter side. He said he's got a good one in there that he wants to hold up. Go ahead and hold it up. Walk right out there. Joe Whelan, five pounds, eight ounces today. Two-day total, 12 pounds and two ounces Gonna get a weight on this one. I believe it's gonna be a little bit short of big bass, but Joe, we want to get a weight on this spot of bass. Is that the biggest spot you've caught? No, I just, uh, the biggest one all week for sure. I, I had to see that one. Hey, I'd like to thank my wife and my son, Vicki and Ben, for being here this week, all helping me out all week. Uh, St. Louis Bass Busters back home. Guys, good luck in the state tournament this week. Hello to my whole family, the Waylands. I love y'all. And I had one more to say. I'm listening, somebody. Where is it? I'd like to thank my sponsors. JustGaragePlans.com if you're looking for a garage or shop building, buy it from a fisherman that's helping you build it. Well, that sounds good, Joe, man. Thank you. Second place currently, so don't go don't go running off on me now. Two-day total, 12 pounds and two ounces out of Texas. Byron Albrick. Byron. Byron's bringing us four today. Four today? Come on up here. 8-12 to start the day. 8-12 to start the day. Maybe a little bit less than that, I believe. Absolutely less. <laughs> How about 6-7 for you? 6-7 for you, Byron. Ninth place right now, but a uh, long, long way in, right? Correct. There's a lot of people back there. Anybody want to say hello or thank you to, man? No, I'm good. I'm good. Rough week. 
Rough week. It's been long. <laughs> Rough week and a long one, man. Thank you, Byron. Well, we sure do appreciate you. Byron, 15 pounds and three ounces two-day total. Next up, these two guys rode out, and they said they were going to catch them this morning. That's what they told me. Garrett Sicily and Jerry Pate. Garrett Sicily out of Vermont, back to back, two in a row, one nine yesterday, four today, four today, they're going to go a little bit heavier than one nine, so man, made some adjustments. Yeah, you know, it it wasn't as hard today, it was a struggle getting that, trying to get that fifth, fifth fish, but yeah, not too bad. Well, four three, four today, four three, five twelve for the event, and uh. Anybody want to say hello or thank you to? Uh, my wife, uh, everybody back home. My wife's taking care of the kids right now. Uh, shout out my sponsors, uh, North Point Chrysler Dodge in Derby, Vermont, Green Mountain Sporting Goods. Um, I wouldn't be here for, if it wasn't for them. I had a great time, so wait until next year. Awesome, Garrett. Thank you, man. And I know I've seen you twice now, so I know I'll see you next year. Let's get his boater up out of Nebraska, Jerry Pape. Jerry had 5.10 yesterday, five more today, five more today, and definitely a little bit of an upgrade. A lot better day today. You know, I've, when I do good, usually i got a jig in my hand, and today I put a jig in my hand, so that helped out a lot. So, How about 11 pounds and five ounces? 11.5, Jerry Pate. He's going to jump himself all the way up into fifth place currently. Sixteen pounds and fifteen ounces, fifth place currently for this Nebraska boater. Jerry definitely did what you needed to do today to to try to get yourself back into a uh, contention here. Yeah, I, I think I'm gonna fall way short because of yesterday. But you know, it, it was a it's great lake. Bass did a great job in the tournament. Uh, I'd like to thank my wife for traveling with me, and we look forward to our thirteen hours tomorrow. Oh, you look forward to that. Well, not really. I'm being a little, little, you know, sarcastic. Oh, yeah. Well, I didn't pick up on that. Man, Jerry, thank you, dude. It's been an honor to get to know you this year. 16 pounds, 15 ounces. Jerry Pape out of Nebraska. Brad Gandy and Matthew Noble rolling on up here. Of course, Mr. Brad on the non-boater side, he's going to come and see me first today. Had 110 yesterday, bringing us one more today. One, one today. Let's get a weight on that one, Brad. 115 on that one, 115 on that one, man. But yesterday and every, even today when you went out, man, you always, you're always excited. You're always happy. Oh, well, yeah, I appreciate that. <laughs> And uh, I was going to tell my wife, I'll be home in about two hours. <laughs> Not 13. Not 13. And my neighbor, I, I, he, I know he's watching, so, ah, we always do that to each other. So, <laughs> Well, Brad, oh, that's right. You had to, man. Thank you, Brad. And we sure do appreciate you fishing with us. Let's get Mr. Matthew Noble up here out of Louisiana. Eight even yesterday. And bringing some extra cargo up here today along with these fish. Who you got with you, Matthew? This is my daughter, Emery. You want to say, hey, Emery? Hey. Did, did, did Daddy catch him today? Um, we catch one big fish. One big fish. Well, how about we let him hold that one up? You want to hold it up? Yeah. All right, there we go. How about six pounds, 13 ounces for you today, Matthew? Six pounds, 13 ounces for you, Matt? Go ahead and grab one up and go get a quick picture out there two day total for matt noble 14 pounds and 13 ounces man how cool is that bringing her up on this stage it's awesome it's been a disappointing week i never really i never really had a clue to be honest uh 
but it was fun, and we're already qualified for next year, so we'll try again. I just want to thank my whole families here and everybody back home. I got a million texts this week. I appreciate everybody. Well, Matt, we sure do appreciate you, man. And, man, I can't wait to see you next year right here on this stage. Let's keep it on rolling out of Alabama on the non-voter side. Richard White bringing us five today. Had ten four yesterday. And this Alabama voters got five more today. Richard White right here in the middle. 10-4 to start the day. Five to go with it. Look out. Non-boater. Looking to take home that non-boater trophy today. Richard White out of Alabama. Come on. Seven pounds and nine ounces, Richard White, all the way up to first place on the non-boater side out of Alabama. Two-day total, 17 pounds and 13 ounces, and we got a new leader on the non-boater side. Richard, 17-13, had 7-9 today. Solid way to back up 10 yesterday. Yeah, a little bit tougher day today, but we caught a lot of fish and had a good time. Uh, I don't know if that's going to hold up. Maybe it'll get us up there a little bit, but it's been a great week. Enjoyed it. Had some great boaters, man. I couldn't, uh, couldn't ask for two more nicer guys this week. Uh, just great day, man. Well, man, what a, what a day to have a great day. Again, 17-13, man, and you just took over the non-boater lead, so why don't you go jump on that hot seat and sit there for a little while. Give Richard White a big round of applause. This next guy coming all the way from Arizona, Frankie Mueller. Frankie had eight pounds even, five more today. Five more today. Eight even yesterday. Get a weight on these five. A little bit better day for you, Frankie. Nine pounds and 11 ounces. Frankie Mueller up to fifth place on the boater side. Fifth place currently. Nine eleven today. Two-day total. 17 pounds and 11 ounces. Frankie, fifth place currently. Probably going to need a little bit more for you this week to hang on. But uh, awesome, awesome week getting here, and I know you had a great time. Yeah, it's always fun coming here. It's my second time. I'd love to make it back next year. It's going to be hard. Not much on the West. So, uh, you know, I thanks to my wife for allowing me to go do this and putting up with me. And thank you to Kingman Bobcat uh, Mertens, the Bobcat dealership around there, and Guys in my bass club, Havasu Bass Club, thank you guys. You helped me out to get here. And Blaine Ruddy and his wife and my parents up there were awesome this week. As I've been told, they're the loudest ones here. So thank you guys for that. They got a little competition, but I'm going to give it to them right now. They got really loud. They got really loud when you came up here. Yeah, they like to make noise. But I had good partners both days. I was definitely around the quality. I'm just I, – I couldn't catch them, so – I hope he holds on to it, man. He's a great guy, good fisherman. So, yeah, that's funny. That's fishing sometimes, man. Sometimes that you can you can look at them, look at them, and they just won't they just won't bite. Yeah, I, I watched them all both days, and they wouldn't bite. Well, Frankie, I know I'll see you back very soon, man, and uh, I look forward to it. Seventeen eleven, Frankie Mueller, give him a big round of applause as he exits the stage. 
Next up, Roger Forker. Roger out of Delaware. Had 112 yesterday. 112. Got one more to add to that today. Roger, one more today. Tough event for you. Tough event for you. It was very tough. Uh, I had a good practice down here, and I enjoyed every day that I was down here. You guys threw on a heck of a tournament. Everything was cool. I just want to thank Jim, the president of Delaware Bass Nation, for coming out and support me, my wife, my daughter, Lily. Thank you, guys. That's awesome, Roger, man. Let's give Roger a huge round of applause, man, and I look forward to seeing you again. Roger Forker, 1-3 today, 2-15 for the event. This next guy. He left this morning in third place out of Maryland, Andrew Sams. And it looks like he picked up right where he left off, bringing us five more today. Had 14-8 yesterday, 14-8 yesterday. Looking. How about seven pounds, 14 ounces? Andrew Sams all the way up to second place. Second place currently for this Maryland boater. Seven pounds and 14 ounces. Seven, 14. Two-day total, 22 pounds and six ounces. Man, if I recall, you, you caught him yesterday, but you, did, well, you, you didn't have many bites, I don't think. And a uh, little bit tougher day for you today. Do we think it's going to hold out? I don't know. I don't think so. It was definitely a, a different day today. I probably had the same amount of bites as, you know, that I did yesterday. They just weren't the quality. Um, I don't know where those big fish went, but they weren't where I was at. So, I mean, that's fishing. Well, man, 22-6, two-day total. Anybody you want to say hello or thank you to? Yeah, all, uh, all my friends, family back home for supporting me, uh, my girlfriend Beth, um, everybody for being out here. This is, this is a big crowd. Um, and then you guys, as always, this is – this is my third championship. Um, I know the format's changing next year, but it's always a great event. I know the, the ones moving forward are going to be great also. Well, Andrew, I sure do appreciate that, man, and I look forward to seeing you back next year. Andrew Sams out of Easton, Maryland, 22 pounds and 6 ounces. Next up, Hunter Fredrickson. Hunter Fredrickson out of Michigan on the non-boater side, and he got to ride with Jess Pottinger today. Let's get him on up here. Hunter Fredrickson had a really good start yesterday. Solid start. Six pounds, ten ounces. And you got five more today. Let's slide on up here when Mr. Glenn gets these folded up. He says they're lively. Five fish for you. Six, ten yesterday. How about five pounds and an ounce? Five pounds and an ounce, Hunter Fredrickson. Fifth place currently on the non-boater side. Hunter Fredrickson, two-day total, 11 pounds and 11 ounces. Hunter, 11, 11, 11, 11, two-day total, and uh, fifth place currently, but uh, obviously there's a lot of guys coming behind you. Uh, I'm su super blessed to be here. I'm happy I caught five both days all i could ask for i mean it's a very tough place to uh come as a co-angler and try and catch fish so the fact that i caught five each day was i'm happy with that um i just want to thank everybody for family and friends back home michigan bass nation all the friends i've made through this whole circuit and the five years it took me to get here so very excited and happy to ho hopefully i'll be able to come back and do this again well i look forward to it hunter thank you next guy on the boater side, out of Idaho, Jess Pottinger, 10 pounds and 13 ounces to start the day. And he's got five for us. 
Jess, looks like it might have been a little bit better day for you today. A little bit better day for you today. 10-13 to start the day. How about 9 pounds, 13 ounces, Jess Pottinger up to fifth place on the boater side. 9-13 for you. Today, 9.13 for Jess. Two-day total, 20 pounds and 10 ounces. 20 pounds and 10 ounces. Jess, solid week for you here this week. 20 pounds, 10 ounces, fifth place currently. Yeah, it was a it was an awesome week. I, I'm super grateful to be here. Thank you to everyone back home, Idaho Bass Nation, my parents, everyone who supported me. Uh, this was my first time fishing uh, the nation as a boater, so I'm I'm blessed to make it here the the first try, and I learned a lot this week, and can't wait to to try and come back and do something better next. Well, that sounds good to me, Jess. Thank you, man. Look forward to seeing you again. Next up, Will Presley and Ken Day. Will Presley bringing us three today. Had two, two to start the day today. Three more. But uh, unfortunately, you, you said, yeah, you need to go swing for the fences. Did we try to get that done today? I tried. I tried my hardest, and this didn't happen for me. Well, man, how about four pounds, ten ounces for you? Six, twelve, two-day total. Anybody you would like to say hello or thank yeah, you to? Yeah, I want to say thanks to my wife and uh, all the guys in the club and Ohio Bass Nation. I had a great time. You guys run a great tournament. and. I'll be here next year. Well, Will, appreciate you, man. Look forward to seeing you again. Will Road with Mr. Ken Day. Ken Day, all the way from Washington State, bringing us five today. Had seven even yesterday, five more today. Seven even yesterday, but it looks like those big bites eluded us again. Oh, yeah. They, they don't like me here at all. What do they have? You had 7-7. Seven, seven. Oh, okay. I upgraded. Seven ounces. How about that? There we go. So uh, I want to thank my people back at work, uh, my wife. We're going to start our four-day journey home tomorrow. Um, and so we'll be home by Tuesday. So. Well, man, that, that's a trek, I'm sure. I know it is a trek, actually. But a uh, two-day total, 14-7, Ken. And, man, we sure do appreciate you fishing with us. Thank you. Look forward to seeing you again. Keep them on rolling on through. These guys coming up. Jesus Morales. Jesus all the way from Mexico. Bringing us three today. Give him a big round of applause. Jesus Morales, 4-11. 4-11 to start the day, and you got three more for me today. Yeah, we got another three. Tough day. Tough day, tough day. Let's get a weight on them. How about four pounds and two ounces? Two-day total, eight pounds and 13 ounces. Anybody want to say hello or thank you, too? Uh, thank you for everybody in Mexico. Say hello for all the friends, all the family. Thank you for everything. Uh, great event, this, this tournament. Well, hey, Suze, man, thank you so much. And I look forward to seeing you next year. This next guy reigns all the way from South Dakota, Troy Didi. And look out, Troy can't even get that bag out of the live well. Bring us five today. Five today for Troy Didi. Had 914 yesterday, 914 yesterday. It looks like we got somebody up here with us today. Yes, this is uh, Micaiah, the soon-to-be middle child. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Anything you want to say? How'd your dad do today? Good, I think. Well, how about we find out? Let's get a weight on these five right here for you, Troy. Eleven pounds even, Troy Deedy, all the way up to fourth place. Fourth place for the South Dakota boater. Troy Deedy, 11 pounds even. 
two-day total, 20 pounds, 14 ounces. Give him a big round of applause. And, man, Troy, man, that's I know that's what it's all about. You getting to bring your entire family here. I know you love that kind of support. Absolutely. I couldn't do with couldn't do without them. Um, they are truly the uh, the backbone of what makes this possible. Um, I just want to say thank you to my mother-in-law and my, and my family for being here. All the words of encouragement that I've received this week. Uh, the Bass staff and um, just the support that they give us behind the scenes. Um, and uh, thanks to uh, South Dakota Bass Nation for supporting me and uh, my co-angler. And uh, last but not least, I just want to thank the good Lord for blessing me with another day to fish. Well, that sounds good, Troy, man. We sure do appreciate you. And 20 pounds, 14 ounces. Let's see how long that'll hold out for you. Fourth place currently. Keep them on rolling. Coming out of Utah. And he has been here. A lot of times, and he's bringing us five. Had a tough day yesterday, bringing us five today out of Utah. Greg Pink. For an old guy, that's a hell of a step right there. Yeah, whoever that driver is, they got to get a little closer. I think he ought to practice his parking a little. How about, Greg, eight pounds even, eight pounds even for you today. Grab a couple of those up. Hold them up, Greg. Had zero fish yesterday. Eight even today has jumped all the way up to 14th place on the non-boater side. Big day two comeback for this Utah non-boater. Greg, man. Come here and talk for a minute, man. I know you've been here tons of times, but always great to have you back. Yeah, well, it's fun to be back. I don't know how many years I can keep doing this, but uh, I enjoyed it. Yesterday was a fun day. Didn't catch much, but today was a fun, funner day. Caught a few fish, called a little bit. I ate your sandwiches, though. Did you enjoy those? I was going to save you a sandwich. You were hungry yesterday, but... I was sitting out in the water, and it just hit me. I figured I better eat and get my nourishment. So, sorry. Yeah, well, you know, I guess I'll just be hungry. I didn't even get to eat lunch today. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Thank you, Greg. Eight pounds even. Give him a big round of applause. Huge day two comeback. But let's get his boater on up here out of Nevada. Cody Steckel, and he's got five eleven one eleven one. And look out. He's pulling one off of a coal clip. So that's, you know what that means. Get loud. Look at that big old Lake Hartwell spotted bass. Cody had 11-1 to start the day. Had 11-1 to start the day. Needs a really big bag to jump into the lead. Don't think he quite has that, but a really solid day, too, for this Nevada boater, Cody Steckel. Twelve pounds, four ounces, and with that, Cody Steckel moves all the way into second place on the boater side. 12 pounds and 4 ounces. Cody Steckel, two-day total, 23 pounds, 5 ounces. Cody, 23-5, two days, two very consistent days, and you upgraded a little bit today. Yeah, could have had a little bit more. Uh, broke one off in a cane pile today, so it looked like it was a three, four pounder, but got to just keep fishing and keep going. And got to say a huge thank you to my family and all my friends back at home for watching, and uh, I hope I can get out there tomorrow. Well, man, we'll find out. Obviously, a pretty long way in, but sitting in second place, you got to like where you're feeling right now. Yeah, I'm just hoping to make it tomorrow, that's all. Man, we'll see how it shakes out, Cody. Thank you. Two-day total, 23 pounds and 5 ounces. It 
Look at these two. Look out. Andrew Sales out of Wyoming. Andrew on the non-boater side out of Wyoming, bringing us four today. Had six pounds and ten ounces yesterday. Six ten yesterday. Got us four more today. Six ten for you yesterday, Andrew. Four pounds, three ounces, four pounds, three ounces for you. Two-day total. Andrew's going to get a picture with him. Go ahead and grab him up, Andrew. Two-day total. Andrew sells out of Wyoming. Ten pounds, 13 ounces. Man. Man, needed a little bit more, Andrew, but, man, I know you had a great event. You know, fun time being here, and I always enjoy getting to hang out with you for a couple days. Yeah, it was it was a fun event. I had a fifth fish on, uh, caught it out of a brush pile about 40 foot, got him up to the boat, and it was a catfish. Golly. <laughs> but I've really had a great time. Appreciate being here. Looking forward to next year's championship, if you want to tell us where it's at. Um would be great. I want to thank uh, Coyo uh, Cowboy Bass, Wyoming Bass Nation. Had some great time with some boaters here. I want to thank my wife, my friends, who's been blowing up my phone with Facebook and text messages at 2 o'clock in the morning. It's kind of crazy, but this has been an awesome event. I've been trying to get here for 29 years, so it's really special. This is my classic. 29 years, and Andrew Sales is right here on this stage. Andrew, man, an absolute honor to share it with you. Thank you, Andrew. Give him a big round of applause. 10-13, two-day total, Andrew Sales. And he rode with B.J. Baxter. B.J. Baxter out of Ohio, bringing us five today. Had 11 pounds and an ounce yesterday for this Ohio boater. BJ, 11-1 yesterday, 11-1 yesterday, bringing us five lively ones. A little bit tougher day for you today, it looks like, man. Anybody you want to say hello or thank you to? Yeah, I'd like to say thank you to all my sponsors that let me be able to do this stuff, and my wife and my kids and everybody back home. Well, how about 9-8 for you, BJ, 9-8? You want to Go ahead and hold a couple of those up. BJ Baxter out of Ohio. Nine eight today. Nine pounds and eight ounces. Had eleven one yesterday. Two day total. Twenty pounds, nine ounces. BJ Baxter. BJ Baxter. Twenty nine. Twenty nine. Two day total. Ninth place currently. Keep it right on rolling. He is rolling up again out of North Dakota. Had a really good start to day number one. Had 13 pounds and 12 ounces. Tyler Darling. Tyler's bringing us four today. Four today for you, Tyler. 13, 12 yesterday, but, man, a little bit tougher day today for you. Yeah, I got about half that today. Man, 13, 12, what's to get a weight on these? While we're waiting, anybody you want to say hello or thank you to? Uh, wife, kids, um, family, friends, everyone back home. Well, man, 6-3 today, 6-3 today, Tyler, and I know I will see you again. All right, man, thank you. Safe travels back to South Dakota. Tyler's from South Dakota, fishing for North Dakota this week. 6-3, 19-15, two-day total. Next up. Rolling on out of here. Keep them rolling. Spotted bass are lively. Man, Richard. Richard. It was a tough day, I guess. You're still sitting here. 
There's some tough ones coming, though. There's some big sacks from yesterday still to come. So. There's a lot of big ones, but, man, you're, you've been sitting here a long time. We'll see how long We'll see how long this thing holds out for you. How about that? Keep them on rolling. Coming on up, Ron Steerstorfer out of Maryland. Ron's got us five today. Five today. Had seven pounds and 15 ounces yesterday. Ron's got us five more. Five more for Ron. 7.15 yesterday. 5 pounds, 15 ounces. 5 pounds, 15 ounces for Ron. Go ahead and hold those up. Ron jumped all the way up to second place on the non-boater side. Ron, steer story for 5 pounds, 15 ounces today. Two-day total weight, 13 pounds and 14 ounces. Man, a little bit tougher day for you. Got you in second place, though, right now, 13 pounds and 14 ounces. Yeah, I couldn't be more pleased. I brought nine in every two days here, first event, had two great boaters, and uh, I want to thank my wife for putting up with me and letting me do these things. Well, Ryan, we'll see how long it'll hold out for you. Second place currently, 13 pounds and 14 ounces. Let's get Ron's boater up here out of Mississippi, Chad Warnall. And Chad had three six yesterday, but he's bringing me five today. Yeah, a little better today. Um, I changed up a few things. I will find a few fish, so uh, it ain't nothing too special, but I'm happy to have a limit for sure. Thank the Lord for that. How about seven seven for you, Chad? Seven seven. Two day total ten pounds and thirteen ounces. Anybody you want to say hello or thank you to? I want to say thank you to the Lord first and foremost. Uh, give me the great blessing of being here and the ability to to, to make the, the regional to be here. Um, safety and travels as well. Uh, say thank you for family and friends at home. Uh, help me out to you know get here and uh, Bass Nation uh, and Anderson. Everybody's put on a good show here. It's been a great time. Well, Chad, we sure do appreciate that. And safe travels back home to Mississippi. Chad Warnall, seven seven today. Two day total, ten pounds and thirteen ounces. Coming on up, David Pfeiffer. David Pfeiffer, look out! David's got us four today. Four fish today. He had one pound and five ounces yesterday. Man, David, nice little recovery for you today. Not bad, not bad, not bad. A little better today. Let's see what we can get for you. One five, one five. Yesterday, how about seven pounds and an ounce today? Seven pounds and an ounce. Grab a few of those up, David. David Pfeiffer, two-day total, eight pounds and six ounces. Man, David, uh, that was a nice spot. Is that your big spot? Yeah, it was my biggest one yet so far. So I had a great boater here and uh, had a good time. Maybe next time we'll get a little bit more. Well, man, I sure hope so, David. Man, thank you for fishing yeah, with I us. Give, uh, Rob Smith, uh, Maine Bass Nation president, a shout out for coming down and watching us and, and all he does. Man, how awesome is that? These presidents, there's a ton of them out there in the crowd watching all of their anglers compete. Again, give those presidents a huge round of applause. Thank you, David. Let's get this next guy on right on up here, rolling out of California. And he's bringing us four, Aust or he's bringing us five. Austin Bonjour. Austin had 10 pounds, 10 ounces yesterday. I'm making you dance around back here. 10, 10. How about 10 pounds and seven ounces? Austin all the way up to fourth place. Go ahead and get a quick picture, and then we'll talk for just a second. Austin Bonjour out of California. Fourth place currently. Fourth place currently on the boater side. Two-day total, 21 pounds and an ounce. 21 pounds and an ounce. And two, uh, two very, very consistent days for you here at the Nation Championship. 
Yeah, um, can I take this for a minute? Uh, I just want to say thanks to this crowd. Holy smokes. This is awesome. Thank you, guys. Uh, thanks to J JL. I didn't. GL, sorry. Uh, JL, GL, whatever. They're right. I'm from California, so, and I've been fishing for like five days, drove for five days, I'm tired. I just want to say thanks to my wife, my dad, he's over there, th always in the camo like me. Uh, we're deer hunter fishermen, and uh, also thanks to everybody watch watching back home. I love all you guys. I got a, one of the best support systems in the world, and they're watching all over California right now. Love you guys. Sorry I didn't uh, have 12 pounds and 12 pounds, but pretty consistent, just not enough this week. Well, since sitting in fourth place currently, man, and, man, it's been an absolute honor to get to know you, and I look forward to seeing you again. Austin Bonjour, two-day total, 21-1. Keep it rolling. Out of Tennessee, out of the Tennessee Bass Nation High School program, let's welcome him to the stage, Tristan Boyd. Tristan's bringing us four today. Man, Tristan, good to see you, dude. Good to see you. Six, eight to start the day, bringing us four more, four more today. Let's get a wait on those, and then I'll talk to you for just a second. See how far up that leaderboard we can get you. How about four pounds, nine ounces, four pounds, nine ounces. Got you in ninth place, Tristan. And, man, what a feat. Out of the high school ranks. All the way through the adult regionals and right here to the Bass Nation stage. Give Tristan Boyd a big round of applause. Man, how cool is that? Man, it's awesome. It's awesome to make it here so early in the uh, career and um, do good. Or at least catch fish. No, it's going to be a solid event for you. Ninth place currently. And, man, I mean, you know, obviously there's some more guys to weigh, but a very solid event for you here this week. Yes, sir. Um, I'd like to thank my dad mainly. He's done a lot for me, he, and also David Lowry. He's done a lot for me. I'd like to thank the whole family back at home and all that, and uh, get them next time. Well, man, I look forward to seeing you back, Tristan. Give him a big round of applause all the way out of high school. 11, 11, 11, 1, 11, 1. Two-day total for Tristan Boyd. But Mikey Mello Jr. coming out of Massachusetts, bringing us two today, nine even yesterday, Mikey. Tougher day today. Yeah, you got to get them in the boat. I downsized line and uh, broke off a few that would have helped, but I wouldn't have had 15 today, so it wouldn't have mattered. Nine pounds even. Nine pounds even. Going to get a weight on these two. While we're waiting for that thing to lock in, these lively spotted bass here at Lake Hartwell, any hellos or thank yous? Absolutely, Holly. Uh, I got my wife, kids here. Uh, I got five kids, so to be able to do this is uh, is awesome. She's uh, She's my rock, so. I love you, and uh, we just had a baby, so we're excited. <laughs> Man, that's awesome. 213 for you today, 213. Two-day total, 1113, Mikey, and I sure do look forward to seeing you again. Keep them rolling. All the way from Colorado to right here in South Carolina. On the non-voter side, Marshall Allen. Marshall Allen, 7 pounds and 15 ounces yesterday. Had a solid start on the non-voter side. Bringing us three today. Three today. A little bit tougher day for you, though, Marshall. It was a tougher day. Uh, fished a little shallower. I just want to thank my family for showing up, uh, my brother watching back home, my son who's watching back home. Just thanks for the support, guys. First time at Hartwell. Loved it. Looking forward to coming back. Well, he had three good ones, six pounds and eight ounces, and Marshall Allen all the way up to second place on the non-boater side. Six pounds and eight ounces, Marshall Allen. Two-day total, 14 pounds, 7 ounces, 14-7. Next up, on the boater side, out of Portugal, Luis Tavares Mendez. And he had 6-11 yesterday, and he's bringing us 5 today. 5 fish. 5 fish for Luis Tavares. 
six eleven yesterday. Eight pounds and eleven ounces. Luis Tavares. Huge recovery today. Give me let him hold these fish up right here. Luis Tavares Mendez. Eight pounds and eleven ounces all the way from Portugal on the boater side. Give Luis a huge round of applause right here. All the way from Portugal. These guys flew over here. Had very little knowledge of this fishery. Fifteen pounds, six ounces, two day total, Luis. And anybody you want to say hello to back home? Hello back home, Portugal. Obrigado a todos. Man, thank you, Luis. Man, looks forward to having you back, man. We really do appreciate you guys. Man, how hard is it to travel all the way across the world to fish in a bass tournament, compete on the Bass Nation stage? Man, that is just so awesome for these international anglers that we have here. Again, eight countries represented this week right here at the Bass Nation Championship. Keep them rolling. Non-boater out of Nebraska, Blake McCumber. Blake's got us two today. Two fish today for Blake. Come on up here, Blake. Blake's got us two today. Two fish today for Blake McCumber out of Nebraska. Right here in the middle, Blake. Man, good to see you today. Good to see you again today. Bringing me some fish today. Two fish for you. But I know you got a you got an eight o'clock flight, so you got to get on the move, man. Yeah, I want to give a special thanks to Bass for hosting such a great event. And also, I threw a wrench in the way in. And GL and the rest of the staff got me off the water early so I can make my flight. So big thank you to you guys. Thanks to everyone at home watching, and thanks to Lake Hartwell because it was a fun week. Well, Blake, I sure do look forward to seeing you again. Go ahead and hold up a couple really quick. Two fish today for four pounds and six ounces. Four pounds, six ounces. That is his two-day total weight. Blake McCumber out of Nebraska. Next up, out of West Virginia. Had six pounds and ten ounces yesterday, bringing us five today. Dustin Holland. Dustin, 6.13 yesterday, five fish today. A little bit of an upgrade? A little bit. Um, started out pretty good with a three-pounder. Let's get a weight on these five. Dustin Holland, nine pounds, 13 ounces for Dustin. All the way up into 14th place. 14th place on the boater side for this West Virginia boater. There's a good Lake Hartwell largemouth right there. Two-day total for Dustin, 16 pounds and 10 ounces. And I know you got a couple thank yous. Yeah, I want to thank uh, West Virginia Bass Nation, um, Bugsy Bass USA, um, my buddy Brad Spears, a um, couple other friends, Dana Brown, um, and Bass and Anderson. It's been awesome. Well, man, I'm sure glad you enjoyed it, Dustin. And uh, get back to West Virginia and be safe for us, man. 16 pounds, 10 ounces, two-day total. Keep it on rolling. Des Ruffin and Taylor Umlin. Richard says he's just going to keep sitting there. Des Ruffin. Des comes out of Washington State. 113 yesterday, and he's got five fours today. Five fours today for Dez Ruffin. Dez bringing me five today, man. Let's get a weight on these. A lot better day. Yeah, you know what? You told me to get a better hook today, so that's what I did. I kept them all today. Said he kept them all buttoned today, Dez. Looking. Got a good solid bag here. 
Look out, 9 pounds, 14 ounces, 9 pounds, 14 ounces. And Dez Ruffin, with that, jumps all the way up to 7th place currently. 7th place currently on the non-boater side. Dez has 11, 11, 11, 11, two-day total, man. And 7th place, a lot of way in left, but... Man, way to make a huge comeback on day two. Yeah, man, I appreciate it, man. I appreciate everything you guys do down here, all the support and the amenities here. You guys do a fantastic job. I just want to thank everybody back in Washington for all the uh, warm texts and support. Coming home soon, guys. Well, Des, man, we sure do appreciate you, man. I look forward to seeing you again. Let's get his boater on up here. Taylor Umlin out of Illinois had 12-13 yesterday. 12-13 yesterday for you, Taylor. He's got me five more. Five more. Five for Taylor. Again, consistency is the key this week. 12, 13 yesterday. 10 pounds and 11 ounces today. Taylor Umlin jumps up into second place currently on the boater side. Second place for this Illinois boater. Ten eleven twenty three eight two day total twenty three eight two day total for you Taylor, a little bit tougher day today but pretty consistent. You know I'm trying to stay consistent but it's getting tougher and tougher with all the pressure they have on this lake. I need a big bite. I had a big bite every day of practice and it just hasn't happened. I can consistently call up to that eleven pound mark but one that pushes you over into that thirteen fourteen is really what you need here. Taylor, man, we uh, you're in second right now, and uh, let's see if you can maybe go get that big bite tomorrow if we if you get to hang around. Good luck, Taylor. Twenty three eight two day total. Carl. Bowser out of Indiana. Indiana Bass Nation. Carl Bowser. Come on up here. Bringing me one today. One today had one six yesterday. Had one pound six ounces yesterday. One more today. Obviously a very tough week for you here at Lake Hartwell. But, man, great to see you again. Yeah. I got to fish with probably the two best fishermen uh, in this tournament. So I wish them the best of luck. And uh, it was a great tournament. Well, Carl, I know you probably got a couple thank yous you want to get done and uh, before we get you off this stage. Okay, I'd like to thank my employer, uh, Jim Coke Instructors, uh, for understanding how much time it takes to do this stuff. Uh, friends and family and all my guys back at home in the club, uh, Dave Goodman, George Seymour, Bill Holbrook, um, everybody. I'm probably forgetting people, and thanks to Brian Hensley for practice. Well, Carl, man, we sure do appreciate you, and I look forward to seeing you again. Had two pounds even, two-day total for Carl Bowser coming out of Michigan on the boater side. He's digging them out. Nick Rand. Nick had a really good day yesterday. Had 14 pounds and five ounces, 14.5 to start the day, and he's got five more looking for 12 pounds and an ounce. 12 pounds, 9 ounces, Nick ran all the way to the top of the leaderboard into first place. Out of Michigan, Nicholas ran. Nick ran two-day total, sitting in first place on the boater side right now. 26 pounds and 14 ounces. Man, Nick, obviously a little bit less weight than you had yesterday, but the bite is getting tougher, and uh, you figured out a way to wrangle up 12-9 and, and put yourself at the top of the leaderboard, and it looks like you're going to be in contention going into tomorrow. Yeah, I'm excited to go fishing tomorrow. Um, I think the weather's going to fall, like, really well into what I'm doing. Um, I really needed a big bite today, and it just didn't happen. So we're going to just go after it tomorrow and hopefully get two big bites. Well, that sounds good to me, Nick. I look forward to seeing you, and make sure you hang around. But uh, anybody want to say hello, quick th hello, or thank you to? 
Yeah, my entire family is here right now. My in-laws, my mom and dad, my wife. We we have a 14-day-old son. He's up there somewhere. I don't even see him. But, but yeah, thank you guys very much for supporting me and being here. Well, Nick, thank you. And uh, make sure you stick around for the top 10 meeting at the conclusion of weigh-in. Let's keep it moving. Keisuke Sakamoto all the way from Japan. He had seven pounds even, seven even yesterday. And he's got four more in that VMC weigh-in bag. Keisuke. Four more today, four more today. Let's get a weight on them. Keisuke, 6 pounds, 10 ounces, all the way up to fourth place as the, on the non-boater side. 13 pounds and 10 ounces, two-day total out of Japan. Keisuke, anybody want to say hello to back home? Uh. え、まず、このような素晴らしい大会にあの派遣してくれたジャパンネーションの皆さん、そしてスポンサーの皆様ありがとうございました。で、え、家族、え、ファミリー、え、が、え、こうやって送り出してくれたので、え、大変嬉し
college angler fishing for Catawba Valley Community College, Grant Harris. Grant had us one pound even yesterday. Man, obviously a very tough day for you today. Yeah, it was, uh, we did a lot of casting, but just sadly no fish. But, uh, Sally, it happens. If it was called catching, everyone would be good at it. That's right, man. That's right. And, Grant, man, we sure do appreciate you. And uh, any quick thank yous? Uh, I'd like to thank my parents, uh, mom and dad who came out. I'd like to thank my uh, college coaches who came out. Uh, appreciate Lenny for everything he's done this week. Uh, I'd like to say uh, hello to all family, uh, teammates back home watching. Uh, and thank you all for putting on this great event and had a great time this week. Well, Grant, man, we are sure glad to have you on this stage, and good luck next year. And how about that? College coach Angela and John Mayo up there in the crowd. How about how awesome is that? College coaches come to support their anglers, even if it's not a college event. But let's get this next guy on up here, Rich Young Jr. out of Kentucky. Rich, 315 yesterday and 2-2 two to two today. One of those tough events, man, and uh, you just got to keep plugging away. Yeah, this is uh, – congratulations to the guys that caught him because I sure couldn't figure it out. He was a better fisherman than me. So uh, I want to thank, thank my wife for coming, all my friends, guys at work for taking care of things while I was gone, um, Kentucky Bass Nation, and people in Anderson do it right. This is an amazing event, and thank the Bass for having this event for us. It's a, it's a really good deal, and fun to be here. Well, Rich, man, I can't thank you enough, man. Great to get to meet you this year, and uh, I look forward to seeing you again, man. 612 two-day total, Rich Young, 213 today. 213 for that Kentucky boater. Keep it rolling right on through. Out of Pennsylvania. Had seven pounds even yesterday, and he's got five more today. Cooper Haas out of Pennsylvania, seven even yesterday. Five more to go with it today. Nine pounds, seven ounces, Cooper Haas. All the way up to second place on the non-boater side. I was sweating that one. I saw it. He, I saw it. I saw him out of corner of my eye. He started turning around a little bit. Cooper Haas, 9-7 today. 16-7, two-day total. And man, yeah, 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 man. 16-7? Yeah. Really good day today for you. And uh, you said you had a quick shout-out. Yeah, I just want to shout out everybody back home. My wife, my, my mother's watching too. Uh, my boy Mike. I especially want to thank uh, PA Bass Nation. I want to thank everybody that hosted this event. Uh, this is pretty kick ass. Everybody did a great job. I had a lot of fun. Uh, I mean, it didn't go the way I planned. I was wishing I could kick him off that seat. But, you know, you, you can't win them all. And I just appreciate everybody's support. So thanks, everybody. Well, man, Cooper, man, it's great to get to meet you. Man, you got a special pin on your hat. Tell us a little bit about that. So uh, when I was growing up, my stepdad got me into bass fishing. He said that, he was like, you know, I'm a Kevin Van Dam fan. And I, he was like, you got to choose somebody. And he's like, you're crazy. He's like, Mike Iaconelli's crazy. So shout out to Mike. Uh, I got to meet him. Uh, I've met him before, but I didn't get to interact with him like I did this weekend. And great guy. It was a great atmosphere at the, uh, at the dinner we had. And I asked him, I said, where can you buy one of those pins? He said, you ain't got to buy it. I'll just give you mine. So I put it on my hat. So... Brought me a little bit of luck. Thanks, Mike. Uh, hopefully, I'll see you all next year. Well, Cooper, man, I look forward to seeing you sitting in second place, currently on the non boater side, 16 pounds and 7 ounces. And Cooper Haas rode out this morning with Riley Nielsen out of Utah. Riley had 11-13 yesterday. 11-13 yesterday. On the boater side. Mm. 
Nine pounds, 15 ounces. Nine pounds, 15 ounces for you, Riley. Hold a couple of those. Lake Hartwell spotted bass right on up. Riley Nielsen, 21 pounds and 12 ounces, two-day total. Riley, I know a little bit short of what you set out to go after this morning. 21-12, got you in seventh place currently, man. We'll see how it shakes out, and, and uh, man, I can see the emotion on your face. So, who, who, a couple thank yous. Um, you know, I can thank my parents. Um. Probably my dad, you know, my dad got me into this a long time ago, and I just enjoy fishing, so I just want to thank my dad for getting me involved in this, and I, I love it, and I hope I keep doing it for a long time. Well, man, Riley, great to get to know you this past year, and I know I'll see you again, 21-12, 21 pounds and 12 ounces, Riley Nielsen out of Utah. Next up, Colton Hutstun. And Matt Abeda. Colton's going to come on up here, bringing his three today. Had six pounds and seven ounces yesterday for this Oklahoma non-boater. Let's get a weight on these three, Colton. Just hit. Six pounds, seven ounces, Colton Hudson. Two-day total. Twelve pounds and 14 ounces. Twelve, 14 for this Oklahoma non-boater. Got him sitting in seventh place on the non-boater side. Colton, need a couple more like those two, man. A couple more like those two, but a solid event for you. Yeah, we were on better quality today. Um, I had three fish that weighed the same amount as my five yesterday. Um, I just want to thank my wife and kid watching at home and Lucky Lure Tackle. It was a great event y'all put on. and um, We gave it to them, did what we could, and I'm happy with what we had. Well, man, safe travels getting back home. Colton, get back to the wife and the kids. And let's get this next guy up here out of New Mexico, bringing us five today. Matt Abeda. Matt had 9-4 yesterday. 9-4 yesterday, Matt. 9-4 yesterday. A lot better day today for this New Mexico boater, and I think they can get a little bit louder out there. Man, they didn't get loud at all. They're feisty. Look at that. They didn't shrink as much today when they were. They told me I had to call it out, but you, you didn't let them settle down in that live well. 10 pounds and 10 ounces. Matt Abeda, 19 pounds and 14 ounces. Jumps into 16th place on the boater side. Nineteen pounds and fourteen ounces, two day total. Ten ten today. And Matt, going to be a little bit short this week, but good, great job today, man. Solid, fun bag, I'm sure. Yeah, it was a great day. I uh, want to thank my Lord and Savior for just uh, allowing me to be here, um, just blessing me with all kinds of different, uh, um, well, he's, he's great in my book. I mean, I've been uh, spending some time with him uh, this last month. It's, it's been really nice. I um, want to thank my family, my friends back home, Bass Nation, New Mexico Bass Nation. You guys do an awesome job. And, uh, yeah, it was really fun. And uh, I want to come back when I can put something better together. But, hey, I'll take it. Well, man, man, Matt, it's been great. And I know you can't be too upset with a cheering section like that. They're awesome. Look at that. Team of Beta. Yeah. Well, man, go. One more thing. I want to uh, thank uh, Kelly and Jolene. They brought their pontoon boat out. I had my cheering section out on the lake today. Um, he lives at Lake Lanier. 
we rented a, a trailer to get that thing over here. It was awesome. That I felt like, you know, somebody on the leaf or something. Every time I catch a fish, I'd like, yeah. Well, man, Matt, that is awesome. That is so awesome, man. And, uh, man, go hang out with him for a little while. Thank you, Matt. 1914, Matt Abeda. Two-day total. This next guy, all the way from South Dakota. He's bringing us two today. Lee Ray Anderson. Lee Ray. He says a way better day because he didn't bring me any yesterday, and he's got two for me today. Yeah, it was still a tough day, but I caught quite a few more. I lost a couple today, but it's better than none, so. That's right. How about one, 13, one pound, 13 ounces for you today. And, man, I heard a couple people hollering your name. Who you got to thank? Uh, everybody. <laughs> I mean, the state of South Dakota Bass Nation for giving me the opportunity to fish and come here and my wife for letting me leave home for a week and a half to fish, and all my family and my boss and Bassmaster for putting on a great event. Well, Lee Ray, we sure do appreciate you, man, and get safe back to South Dakota. And I still hear him hollering your name. How about that? Thank you, Lee Ray. Out of Arkansas. Had 12 pounds even yesterday. On the boater side, Blake Wilson. He says, not happening today. Had 12 even yesterday. Tougher day for you? Uh, yeah, it was tougher to get the quality bites. They were there. Um, washed them. Washed them all day. They just didn't want to eat. Tried everything I, I could think of to uh, to make it happen. And uh, that's the best we come up with today. Seven pounds, two ounces for you, Blake. Seven pounds, two ounces. And, man, it takes so much to get here. I know you got a couple people to say a few words to. Oh, absolutely. I got uh, my wife, for one, uh, watching the baby at home. So I got to thank her. Uh, Arkansas Bass Nation, Bassmaster. Uh, Y'all put on a good show, whether you're, you're fishing or watching it from home, always quality. Uh, and another thing, uh, i got to thank my buddy Gil Sin for your letting me borrow his boat. Uh, I come out here to practice uh, September on the way out here, got rear-ended, and I uh, haven't had a boat in almost six, seven weeks. So <laughs> uh, if it wasn't for him last minute to let me borrow his boat, I don't know what I'd be doing. We'd be kayaking. <laughs> kayaking, he says. Well, Blake. That's what friends are all for, man, and I sure do appreciate you. Absolutely, and thank everybody for showing up. That's right. What a great crowd, Blake. Give Blake Woods a round of applause. 7-2 today, 19-2, two-day total. Next up, out of Arizona, Hayden. Spradling. Hayden had nine seven yesterday, and he's got five today. Five more today for Hayden Spradling. Hayden Spradling nine seven yesterday. Looking for eight, seven, eight pounds, nine ounces. Hayden Spradling, 18 pounds even all the way up to first place on the non-voter side. Hayden Spradling, 18 pounds even. And man, Richard with that. Oh, he's trying to steal the trophy, man. Unfortunately, Richard, man, we say goodbye, and uh, y'all give a good handshake. Hey, let me talk to you for just a minute, Richard. Thank you, man. Give Richard a big round of applause. <laughs> Hayden, 18 pounds even, two extremely consistent days for you. And now you're about to take over this hot seat with a chance to take that trophy home, man. How awesome is that? It's an awesome feeling. Today was a lot harder than yesterday, and uh, I just hope I get to hold this big trophy with my daughter again. That would be awesome. That would be pretty cool. Well, man, go ahead and load that hot seat. And, man, we will see how this thing shakes out. Let's get him up here. Jay Swanson out of Minnesota.
Jay, 810 yesterday. Five for you today. Five for you today. Eight pounds even, eight pounds even for you, Jay. 1610, two day total. Jay Swanson out of Minnesota, 1610. Jay, a couple quick thank yous. Uh, I want to thank the family and friends back home and my wife for coming out here, the Prior Lake Hook Centers for watching, and you guys put on one heck of a show. Well, man, safe travels back to Minnesota, Jay, and 1610, two-day total. Next up, Jason Campbell out of Louisiana, riding with Tyler Ramsey today. Jason Campbell, four fish for us today out of Louisiana. Had three, eight yesterday. Four today. Four today for you, Jason. And, man, a couple quick thank yous. Yeah, I'd like to thank Bass for holding this event. It was a great event. My wife uh, really enjoyed it. And uh, Louisiana Bass Nation, i like to thank. And i like to say hi to all my family and friends back home. Uh, this is good. I was... Uh, yeah, that's it. Thank y'all. Five five today, Jason. Five five. Two day total. Eight thirteen. Man, safe travels. Let's get old Tyler Ramsey up here out of Oklahoma. Had eleven ten yesterday. Tyler, eleven ten yesterday. Eleven ten yesterday. Bringing us five more today. Seven pounds, 13 ounces, seven pounds, 13 ounces for you, Tyler. Who we got right here? Oh, we got my kiddo, Ella, and my wife, uh, Becca. They've been, they've been uh, staying up late every night and getting up early. It's been a, been a fun trip. Well, Tyler, 19-7, 19-7. Anybody else you would like to say hello or thank you to? I want to thank all my family members and friends. They've been really supportive uh, through this whole thing. It's taken a lot to get up here, and uh, I've had a great great time. Well, Tyler, safe travels back to Oklahoma. Two-day total for Tyler Ramsey, 713 today, 197. Robert Roll out of Rhode Island. Robert had 113 yesterday. But he's going to have a little bit more than that today. Five fish today for Robert Roll. And he is digging deep in that VMC weigh-in bag. Look at that, Lake Hartwell largemouth. He has some trying to escape on him. A lot trying to escape, actually. They were all jumping out of that bag. Oh, my, there's another one. He rounded them all up. 113 yesterday. A lot better day today, Robert, out of Rhode Island. A lot better day. I know that was a fun day on the water. Yeah, very fun day. Uh, Cody was awesome. Uh, I'd like to thank my wife, family, Nate. Help me out yesterday. Ten pounds, three ounces. Robert Roll makes a big jump on day number two. Ten pounds and three ounces. Robert's all the way up to tenth place on the non-boater side. Nice Lake Hartwell largemouth. Mixed bag for Robert. Largemouth and spots. Twelve pounds even. Twelve even for you, twelve in, man. What a way to come back on day number two. Yeah, it was. Uh, today was a lot better day. Um, this place is amazing. You know, 
I, I want to thank Bass. I want to thank all the people that uh, do this. It was a lot of fun. Well, Robert, safe travels getting home, man, and I appreciate you. It's a two-day total, 12 pounds even, 12 pounds even. Next up, former Elite Series pro and former Bass Nation champion, Cody Holland, 10-2 yesterday, 10-2 yesterday. He says not not so good today, 10-2 yesterday. Cody, while we're getting these things locked, anybody you want to say hello or thank you to? Yeah, I got to thank you. say thank you to the Jordan family for putting me up for pretty much all last week and then the few days before we leave to go home. And then uh, my wife and stepson for flying in. Um, all my sponsors that helped me get here, IROD, TKO Tungsten, Western Fishing Operations. Um, I know I'm forgetting a few of them, but thank you guys very much. I uh, had a lot of fun out there this week and didn't turn out the way I wanted it to, but this place is still a fun fishery. It was tough, but I had fun. Well, man, Cody, I sure do appreciate it. Seven twelve today, two-day total, 17-14, safe travels back home. And this next non-boater. Raining from Zimbabwe, Gavin Frazier. Gavin, bringing me none today. Yeah, it was a tough day for me on the water, but I uh, had a great time with Nate. He was, uh, had to learn a lot from him today, so uh, it was a good day for me, yeah. Yeah, I'd just like to thank uh, all our sponsors back home um, who help us out to get us here. Um, yeah, that's it. Thanks. Thank you, Gavin, man. Safe travel, safe flight back home. Gavin rode with Nate Caldwell out of Colorado, and Nate's got five for us today. Nate had 12-4 yesterday. He says a little tougher today, but... A lot tougher, he says. 12-4 yesterday. Well, let's get a weight on these five for you, Nate. Twelve four yesterday. A lot tougher. How about 11 pounds even? Nate Caldwell all the way up to sixth place currently on the boater side. 11 pounds even today, 23 pounds, 4 ounces, two-day total. Nate, sixth place currently, sixth place currently, and uh, a lot more guys to go, but uh, we'll see how it shakes out. Yeah, I think there's too many more guys to weigh in. Um, I had a lot of fun this week. Love Hartwell. Um, it was a little tough on me, but I uh, had a good time and want to say hi and thank you to my wife and friends and everyone back home in Colorado. Well, Nate, thank you, man. I appreciate it. 23-4 for that Colorado boater. Matt Summers and Brian Hensley. Matt Summers out of West Virginia on the non-boater side. Had 313 yesterday. 313 for Matt Summers. Bringing us five today. Matt Summers, our Southeastern non-boater champion earlier this year. 313 today. Five more today. So uh, a little bit better day for you. It was a better day, still tough, but uh, much better today for sure. How about six pounds and nine ounces for you, Matt? Six, nine, nineteenth place, ten, six. Anybody want to say hello or thank you to? Yep, I'll thank my wife again for coming with me on this. I want to thank uh, Bass Nation of West Virginia. Thank Bass for this tournament. This uh, this tournament's awesome. I really enjoyed it. This is my first one, and uh, hopefully it's not my last. Well, I sure hope it didn't either, Matt. Thank you. Look forward to seeing you again. Let's get him on up here out of Indiana, Brian Hensley. Brian had 8-5 yesterday. Big jump for him here today. Big jump for a short guy. Man, I, I understand that. Uh, yeah. It, so, it, it had fun today. Caught, caught a lot of fish. Um, they got some really smart fish, I think, here. 
Because we'd be up fishing and catching a few spotted bass, and they'd just start going ballistic out in the middle. And we'd go out there, and they'd be nothing but stripers. They were trying to lure us away from the spotted bass. That's what stripers do. They're smart like that. Yeah, you just, you just got to, you know, ignore them things. That's right, yeah. All right, how about 613 for you today, Brian? And I know you got a couple people, one very special person that you got to thank. Yeah, I couldn't have done this without my wife, Renee. I want to thank her and the uh, Indiana Bass Federation Nation, too. Um, and really, the town, this is a great facility. If, if other towns want to see how to put a tournament on, this is what they should come and look at. Well, thank you, Brian. I know Mr. Neil Paul and Matt Shell will love to hear that. 15 2 for you, two day total. Brian Hensley. Here we go. Another guy reigning from across the pond in Europe. Fernando Enrique out of Portugal bringing us four today. Four today. Fernando bringing us four, four today. 15 ounces yesterday right here in the middle. Let's get you on camera. Of course, all our viewers watching back home on Bassmaster.com, and in this case, maybe across the world in Portugal, anybody you would like to say hello or thank you to? Thank you. Obrigado a todos, a todos, por este momento. Man, thank you, Luke. Fernando. Six pounds, nine ounces. Six pounds, nine ounces for Fernando. All the way from Portugal. Fernando rode with Andy Gill. Andy Gill out of Kansas. Man, tough, tough day for you. Oh, it was a tough week for me. I'll tell you what, it was a, uh, a very bad week. But next week's going to be better. Um, didn't have a lot of missed opportunities. Made a lot of bad decisions. Um, but I'll tell you what. I want to thank my family and friends for supporting me. Um, even though I sucked this week, I'm not going to suck le next week. And I also want to thank Anderson, South Carolina, and Bass, because you guys rolled out the red carpet for us. It made us feel real special, and uh, I really appreciate it. Well, Andy, man, you guys are really special, man. The, the time and effort it takes for these anglers to get here 415, 15 ounces for today, 415. But the time and effort it takes for these anglers to get here, two years to make it to this stage, that is, that is truly impressive. And Andy, he's got one more thing to say. Hey, I want to say I was really excited for Fernando to catch those fish. At the end of the day, we weren't doing too good. We moved to the Windy Bank, and I said, throw a spinnerbait, and he did, and he caught those four fish. And I was, I was really excited for that. Man, that is awesome. That is what it's all about. Andy Gill out of Kansas. Give him a big round of applause. This next guy made the long journey up from the lower part of South Carolina. Ed Owens bringing had 510 yesterday, but he's got five today. Ed had 510 yesterday. Five lively ones, five lively ones. See, got a little Vicky again where she won't get mad at me. How about eight pounds, six ounces for you, Ed? Eight, six for you today. Really good jump on day number two. Great rebound for you. Ed Owens, eight, six today, 14 pounds even. Fifth place on the non-boater side. Ed Owens out of South Carolina. Thank you, Ed. Next up, out of Pennsylvania, Aaron Green. Aaron's bringing us five, 11 pounds and seven ounces to start the day. Eleven seven, Aaron. And, uh, man, who we got with us? We got a future Bassmaster up here. I, I think so. He's he's about as good as on stage as that is. So <laughs> now uh, Nana wanted to see him up here, and I'm sure uh, all his other his other grandparents want to see him up here too. Archer, look out that way. Look at the camera. How about Aaron Green? Eleven one. Go ahead and grab one and get you a quick picture right there. 
Eleven one for Aaron Green. Two day total, twenty two pounds eight ounces. Aaron, couple quick thank yous. Oh uh, yeah, I forgot to thank PA Bass Nation yesterday. I want to thank them and of course all my friends and family for the support. Appreciate it. Thank you, Aaron. Man, great to meet you and uh, good luck. And I know I will see you again. 22-8. 22-8 for Aaron Green. Out of Florida, another one of our high school anglers who unfortunately had a very, very tough week here today. Claude, no fish for me again today. No, no fish. Uh... I just want to thank Florida Bass Nation for getting me here. Uh, none of this would be possible without them, and they're doing a great job down there, you know, making the program better and bringing it back. All right, Claude, man, we sure do appreciate you. Thank you. Claude Lofton, one of our high school anglers, he rode out with Jacob Mark Antonio today. Jacob representing Rhode Island. Two fish for Jacob today. Shaking his head. 5'11 yesterday, man. Ooh. Tough event for you, tough event for you, but, man, what an accomplishment to get here. Again, I, I mentioned it earlier, but two-year road to get here all last year, battling in your states, and then the regionals this year, and finally here on this stage. It feels good to make it here. Um, this lake is definitely a lot to learn and a lot to figure out. Wish I had more time. Need a couple more days, huh? Yeah. <laughs> quick, Some quick thank yous. I'd like to thank my friends and family for supporting me and Rhode Island Bass Nation and Bass Nation as itself for having a great event. Well, Jacob, thank you. Two pounds, 11 ounces for Jacob. Eight, six, two-day total. Next up, rolling out of California. Five, seven yesterday. Ken Pui Wong. He's got five for me today. Doing good, and man, you're bringing me five today. Yep, better than yesterday at least. So still hell on a, on, on, a, on a big fish. So <laughs> ain't got no big ones. No big ones. He said five seven yesterday, six eight today, six eight for you today. Got you in twelfth place, Kim Pui. Ken Pui Wong, 6'8". Today, 11'15", two-day total. A couple quick thank yous, Ken. Uh, I want to thank to everyone. I said it yesterday, but I want to thank everyone from Cope, Stock and Rod Shop. I want to thank my parents for letting me do this. I also want to thank for everyone, all my friends, to support me. Well, man, thank you, and I know I will see you again. 11'15", two-day total. Get him on up here, another guy. With a little bitty drive from down in the lower state of South Carolina, Gary Pope, 9-7 yesterday, bringing us five more today. And maybe we're missing a couple of big bites, it looks like. We let a couple of big bites get loose. I had on enough that it looks like to have made it. I, I probably lost 10 pounds of fish today. Mm. That that will hurt on a tough fishery, especially the way like Hart was fishing right now. Eight ten today, eight ten two day total, eighteen one. Any quick thank yous, Gary? Yeah, I want to say thank you to my wife. She went above and beyond trying to help me on this tournament. Doing, she went and got a trolling motor for me, brought it up here, changed my trolling motor. Thank you, Julie, for your support. Family support's awesome, and we got a little event. At the Redfish Cup, heading down your way in Georgetown next week. 18-1 for Gary Pope. Two-day total. Uh-oh. Look who it is. Dean Yamagata out of Nevada. Come on up here, Dean. Dean's got three today. 
three today. Had three even yesterday. Anybody you need to say thank you to? Thanks to my wife, Penny. And so I don't even know how, how long been we've been married, but we had our anniversary on Saturday, the 14th. You maybe don't know how long you were married. Maybe 33 years. 33, I think. 32 or 33 years. Mm, man, you better get those dialed in. Um, nine four two day total. You had six four today. Gonna come up a little short this week, but Dean, it's been great to get to know you, man. You always got a smile on your face every time I see you. I sure do appreciate you. Come on up here, Oscar Gonzalez. Oscar Gonzalez out of Spain. Two eleven yesterday. Two eleven. Two more today for you. Yes, ma'am. Man, anybody you got to say hello to back home in Spain? Sí, un saludo para toda la gente de España, para mis padres, mi hermana que no ha podido venir, y un saludito a mi colega Jaime que está viéndome. Man, these guys travel so far. Three eleven. He's gonna get a quick picture with these six six two day total. Again, all the way from Spain. Let's give this Spanish angler a big round of applause. Oscar Gonzalez. If you haven't done it yet, go check out Bullseye Branding up there. They got all of your 2023 Bass Nation Championship merchandise shirts and hats. Go give them a look. At, and, uh, man, you better you better get it. Coming up next. Out of Kansas. And he's got us three today. Had 10 15 yesterday. Kyle Klein. Kyle had 10 15 yesterday. A little bit tougher day today, but man, let's see how far up this leaderboard we can get you on day number two. Good job on fish care. Any quick thank yous, Kyle? I know a lot of people go into this. I'd like to thank my uh, cheering section here. We've got Danny, Tate, Travis. Uh, also, like to thank my partner, uh, Andy Gill, having to put up with me this week. Um, also, like to thank my wife and taking care of the kids. And uh, you mentioned the anniversary. We just had our Sunday, so I, I just remembered that too. So I better thank her for 12 years of uh, putting up with me as well. So, anyway. We've been glad to be here, and I had another great partner today, so really enjoyed it. Well, Kyle, man, we sure are glad you're here. 15-8 two-day total, 4-9 today, man. Safe travels back to Kansas. We appreciate you fishing with us. Fifteen eight. Kyle was asking about the non-boater big bass. He still leads that four pounds and eight ounces from yesterday. Again, it's a cumulative big bass for the entire event on the non-boater side and on the boater side. Next up, Kyle rode with Mr. Yoshi Kamada out of Japan, and Yoshi's got five fours today. Had one one yesterday. One one yesterday. Big improvement. Big improvement. Good day. Very good day. Says good day. One one yesterday. Got five. How about eight pounds, 13 ounces? Go ahead and grab those, Yoshi. Get, get a quick picture. Yoshi Kamada, two day total, nine fourteen, nine fourteen. <laughs> he tried his best, but uh, he want to come back here to this tournament again. 
Well, tell you, man, we sure hope to have you back. Yoshi, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate you. 914, two day total for Mr. Yoshi Kamada. Non boater out of Montana. Grant Allmiller bringing us one today. Grant had 10 pounds, 5 ounces yesterday, one today. What happened out there? Yeah, the conditions changed a bit, and just I guess I didn't adjust right, but, man, I fished hard and threw everything I caught them on and some more the last three days. My whole tackle box, I felt like, but that's fishing sometimes, man. It sure is. A couple quick thank yous. Yeah, I just want to thank uh, my family, my mom and dad, for being so supportive, my brothers and sisters, the dittos, um, Jake Boomer, Alpha Angler Rods, uh, Brian at Labino Lures, and uh, last but not least, uh, Montana Bass Nation. You guys are awesome. Uh, and, yeah, thanks for all the fans for coming out here. I mean, you could be anywhere, but you're here. So, cool. It's, that's cool. Well, Grant, we sure do appreciate you. 110 today, 110 today, two-day total, 11, 15, 13th place currently. Thanks, Grant. Let's get him on up here. John Carter out of Maine. John Carter had 12 pounds and 8 ounces yesterday, and he's got five to go along with that. Looking to punch his ticket to tomorrow. Well, how are we feeling? It's going to be very, very close. You know, if it's God's will, it'll happen. If not, we'll be okay. That's right. Got to take what he gives you. John Carter, five fish today. 12-8 yesterday. How about 11 pounds, 2 ounces? 11 pounds, 2 ounces. John Carter on the boater side jumps up into fourth place. Fourth place currently for this main boater. Two-day total, 23-10 for John Carter. John, you said it was going to be close, and it is going to be close. 23-10, um, you got a long way ahead of you now. Yeah, I think it's going to be a little short, but, you know, that's okay. Well, any quick thank yous? Yeah, uh, thank God, of course, and uh, my wife and my mom and the rest of my family and everybody in the main nation who supports me. Well, John, thank you, and, oh, no, thank you. Thank you, John, 23-10. Hayden, you know, the more of these Toyotas that roll through, the better and better you got to be feeling. Uh, it's the more nervous I get. More nervous? What do you mean? You're sitting in the hot seat. Uh, my arms are numb right now from the anticipation, so we'll see how it goes. Well, man, how cool would it be to take home that trophy right there in front of you? It'd be a blessing. Well, let's get these next two up. I know you want me to keep it rolling. Mr. Jim DeAmber out of Massachusetts. Seven eleven yesterday, and you got five more for me today. A little better. Today's uh, my daughter's birthday. Happy birthday, Danielle. Happy birthday to his daughter, Danielle. He said it's a little bit better day. Had seven eleven yesterday. It was a little bit better day for you, Jim. How about eight pounds, two ounces? Eight pounds, two ounces. Go ahead and grab those up. Get you up to 15 pounds and 13 ounces for two days. Fourth place on the non-boater side. Fourth place on the non-boater side. And again, as Jim's grabbing these, the top 10 boaters will advance to tomorrow. As well as the top co-angler. The co-angler is going to take on that tr trophy right there. They will be advancing tomorrow to as a boater as well as a couple more. But Jim, 15-13 and a really good week for you. This has been unbelievable. Uh, I want to thank my wife Mary for letting me come here. And my grandson Teddy's watching. And my son Jimmy. This has been unbelievable. Well, Jim, I sure do appreciate you, man. And it's great kid with you all week. And, uh, man, I know I'll see you again. I will. I'll see you. All right. Sounds good, Jim. Get next up from across the northern border, out of Ontario, Andre Kovanit. Andre had 9-6 yesterday, 3 today, and you're grinning. Not the day I wanted, but it's the day I got. And... We'll take it and move on, right? Nine, six, got three. Let's get a wait on these, Andre. 
While we're waiting, any quick thank yous? Uh, I want to thank the OBN. Um, they've gone a long ways helping me get down here. Uh, York Bassmasters, uh, they were great. Um, my amazing wife, which was down here with the for the week. And thank you guys. You guys went above and beyond with this experience. Happy to be here. Well, Andre, we sure do appreciate that. How about 215 for you today? Two-day total, 12-5. 12-5 for you, Andre. Out of Ontario. Canadian anglers following each other right up right here today. How about Andrew Kraus on the non-boater side out of Ontario? Andrew, better day for you. You had none yesterday, and you got me at least two today. I got only one today. Uh, one. He's only got one, Dan. We'll get that adjusted real quick. All right, let's get this one fish weighed in for you, Andrew. How about one pound, three ounce? Any quick thank yous? Uh, I just want to say thank you to the OBN and all my friends and family who have been here to support me through my this time here. Well, Andrew, that's awesome. Get that fish and hold it up right out there. Man, these guys traveled all the way from Ontario to fish right here at Lake Hartwell, South Carolina. Legendary Green Pond Landing. Anderson, South Carolina, give him a big round of applause. Thank you, Andrew. Andrew riding with your day one leader, Tim Doobie. Timothy Doobie with 16-3. He went out this morning in the lead, and he's got five more in the bag. Five fish in the bag for you, Tim. Tim is looking for 10 pounds and 12 ounces. 10, 12 for you, Tim. Tim's looking to punch his ticket into tomorrow and looking to hold on to the boater lead. 16-3 yesterday. Looking for 10 pounds, 12 ounces. 11 pounds even. Timothy Doobie all the way back into the lead. Back to where he started when he left the dock this morning. 11 pounds even. Two-day total. He's digging these fish out of that VMC weigh-in bag. Two-day total, 27 pounds, 3 ounces. And, Tim, I ain't going to talk to you long because I know I'm going to be talking to you tomorrow. But, man, uh, great job today, 27-3. And uh, I think you're going to have another day up here with me. Yeah, that's what I was looking to uh, looking forward to the most, trying to make a day three here, finally having a decent event. Uh, let's just see if I can go catch five more good ones tomorrow and see what happens. Well, five more good ones, Tim. I look forward to seeing you. 27-3, and he did take over the lead on the boater side. Timothy Doobie. Next up, out of, out of New Jersey. And he took home the trophy at the Northeastern Regional as the non-boater, Zach Queenie. Zach had 8.13 yesterday. Four more for Mr. Zach today. A little bit tougher day for you, Zach, but an awesome year for you. Yeah, uh, this, is a, this was my first year in the nation, and I went into it with the mindset that I just wanted to hang my own, hold my own with the guys from New Jersey. And uh, I, I couldn't ask for more, man. I'm glad to be here with you guys. First year in the nation, and he took home the win at the Northeastern Regional. Give him a big round of applause. Zach Queenie, 5 4 today, 14 1. Couple quick thank yous. Yeah, I want to um, thank all my friends and family back home um, for all the love and support. I uh, want to give a shout out and a thanks to all my sponsors uh, Blackwater Sports Center, Cash and Rods, Flambeau Outdoors, Livingston's, Picasso Lures, Colfort, and P Line. Well, thank you, Zach, and I know I will be seeing you again sometime very soon. 14 1 for Zach. Queenie, this next guy, coming out of Iowa, 9-3 yesterday, Mr. Adam Hammond. Adam's got four fours, two. Tough day for you, Adam, but, man, what does it mean for you to be standing here on this stage? This is my second Nationals. Uh, made Nationals next year already, so I'm super excited, but uh, it's, it's fun getting to this event, and uh, I really enjoy it. I just couldn't figure Hartwell out, so... 
Unfortunately, that's how it goes. 7-10 today, 16-13. Two-day total got you in 27th place. And uh, unfortunately, you're going to be heading home. Anybody you want to say hello or thank you to? Yeah, just friends and family back home. Thanks for watching. Thanks for the support, everybody. The Iowa Bass Nation. You guys have been great. Um, yeah, I guess it's time to head home and see the family. Safe travels back to Iowa, Adam. Thank you. Let's keep this way in rolling. I mean, I know Hayden would like me to just cut this thing right now. It'd be nice. Unfortunately, I don't think any of these other non-boaters would want me to do that. Let's bring this next non-boater up out of Minnesota, Miles Lausch. Miles Lausch out of Minnesota. Had 110 yesterday. You got four for me today. Slide on up here where we can make sure we get you in camera view. A lot better day today. Um, had a lot of fun. Going to come up quite a bit short, but super fun week. Um, couldn't ask for much more. And thank you to the nation for putting on this event. Over the last two years, it's been incredibly fun. Um, would love to come and do it again someday. So, yeah, that's about all I got. Well, Miles, thank you. I hope to see you again. Four pounds, four pounds even today, 5'10", two-day total. And this next guy, again, all the way from Zimbabwe, and he's got his two, Andre Kadanis. Andre, 6'10", two-fourths today, man, two-fourths today. And I know traveling that long of a way, you'd have liked to have, for this to have turned out a little bit better, but, man, awesome to have you here. No, I loved it. Great experience. Tough day for me. I guided well. Both my guys did well in the past two days. <laughs> so it was great. Great day. Thank you very much. Really had a great time. Uh, you and your team, fantastic. Really appreciate it. Well, Andre, that means so much. That means so much. And, man, safe travels back to Zimbabwe. 213 for you today. 9-7, two-day total for Andre. Mike Bell and Mark Leach rolling on up here next. Mike Bell out of New York. Mike's got us four today, four fish. Had a very tough day yesterday with a zero, but he's got four today. So, man, a little bit of a recovery for you. Yeah, I'd say so. Definitely better day fishing. The four bites that I had, I managed to get in the boat. So we're going to see what it does. Um, glad to have my family here. Like I said, that's the biggest part for me. Well, Mike, that's awesome. Four fish for you today. See how far up this leaderboard we can get you. How about that's a good bag? Seven pounds, two ounces. Mike Bell out of New York jumped all the way from a zero yesterday into 32nd place. Seven, two, two day total. Mike Bell. Mike rode with Mark Leach out of North Carolina today. Mark had 7.15 yesterday and a Long little step there for you, Mr. Mark. I see you shaking your head, man. Five fish for you today, 7.15 yesterday. Did we just not figure it out this week? I figured it out this, this afternoon. I, I figured it out a lot more this afternoon. If I wish I could fish tomorrow. Man, I, I wish you could too. Ten pounds even, unfortunately, a little bit short this week. Ten pounds even today for Mark Leach out of North Carolina. Two-day total. Two-day total weight for Mark Leach, 17 pounds and 15 ounces. Give him a big round of applause. Man, Mark, any quick thank yous? Yeah, I'd like to thank God first, and I'd like to thank my wife. She's she's a trooper. I mean, she pulled the camper down here while I pulled the boat. That's that's you know, that's something. She backs the trailer in. She does good. Uh, She's my biggest supporter, my biggest fan, and I, I couldn't do any of this without her. I'd like to thank, um, you know, all my friends and family that's wished me luck. Um, Freightliner for giving me a job, <laughs> be able to afford to do all this. And I'd like to thank Lenny for coming down here, uh, showing up and supporting us. Um, I'd like to thank the nation for putting on an awesome, I mean, they've treated us like like royalty. I, we Like we're the pros. <laughs> Well, Mark, man, I sure do appreciate that, and I know how hard it is to get here, so we want to treat you guys right. 17 pounds, 15 ounce, two-day total for Mark Leach out of North Carolina. Next up, from South Africa, 
on the non-voter side, Nils Vinky. Nils had one fourteen yesterday, bringing me two today. Two fish today for you, Nils, and uh, unfortunately a little bit short this week. But, man, how cool is it to come fish here in the States? Yeah, man, first of all, it's a blessing to be here, and I thank the Lord for that. And I must say, uh, being used to the front of the deck and coming here as a co-angler, it's not easy. So I take my hat off to the co-anglers that did well. And I just want to say thank you now to my family back home. They're holding the fort, my girlfriend Jenna and my little one, Bella. Um, they're my biggest supporters, so I appreciate it a lot. Well, hello all the way from Lake Hartwell back in South Africa. Neil's and safe travels home, man. 2-1 today, 2 pounds and an ounce today, 3.15, two-day total. Next up, out of Connecticut, Mickey Solar. Mickey, 3.11, 4 today, tough event for you. Yes, uh... I pride myself in catching five fish limits, and it was tough for me this week. But I'm looking forward to coming back next year. Well, man, I sure can't wait to see you. And uh, anybody you want to say hello to real quick? Uh, yeah, I would like to uh, thank all my family and friends watching back home. Obviously, the Bass Nation, Sylvia and Vinny run a great program in Connecticut. I also want to thank Bass Nation. GL, you did a wonderful job. I really appreciate it. We have been treated like royalty this week, and I can't wait to come back. Well, Mickey, I sure do appreciate it, man. That means so much to me. And I know I'll see you again. 5.15, 5.15 for you today. Nine pounds, 10 ounce, two-day two day total. Mickey Solar out of Connecticut. Again, reminder, top 10 boaters and, of course, the top co-angler. He can't go nowhere, so I don't have to round him up. Top 10 boaters meeting right back here behind the stage at the conclusion of weigh-in. We will announce you guys up here. And this guy is raining from Idaho. And I know he's got his whole family here out of Idaho digging deep in that live well. Christian Hansen! Christian Hansen, what about that Lake Carl spotted bass? Five fish today after zeroing yesterday. Wow, what an improvement, man. That's a really solid bag. Yeah, I was uh, one day and a dollar short, but, hey, I caught him today. He caught him in a big way on the non-boater side. 11 pounds and 2 ounces. Christian Hansen from zero yesterday and dead last all the way to 21st place on day number two. And Christian, I know you got a little one out there, so uh, I know you got a couple quick thank yous. Yeah, I just want to say thank you to my family, everybody that came out, um, all my family and friends that are watching. Uh, appreciate my uh, coworkers and supporting me and covering while we're gone. And uh, yeah, I appreciate the service crew, um, Trent, Andy, Big Mike. Appreciate you guys a ton for getting my boaters, which is my boat, ready and getting him safe and everything this whole week. So. Appreciate you guys a lot, and uh, we'll be back. Oh, I know you will, Christian. Thank you. Let's give that service crew a big round of applause. They're out there working on these guys' boats all day long to get them back on the water. But let's not stop now. This next guy's rolling out of Alabama, Zeke Gossett. Zeke had 11 pounds and 4 ounces yesterday, and he's got five lively ones. Going to be a little bit lighter maybe than yesterday? Uh, a little bit better, actually. A little bit better? That bag's deceiving me. Oh, wow, a lot better. 13 pounds, 7 ounces. Zeke Gossett all the way up to fifth place for this Alabama boater. Zeke Gossett out of Alabama. Two-day total weight. 24 pounds, 11 ounces, and that's got him sitting inside our top 10 cut currently. Zeke, 13.7, you went out and upgraded on a day that we haven't seen that many upgrades. I know, I finally, uh, I finally got a decent bite, and I actually caught it on my dead last cast. Dead last cast. 
I pulled the trolling motor up and we left. Well, man, that's sometimes what it takes. You know, those late minute heroics got you sitting in fifth right now, twenty four eleven. Yeah, I'm. I'm really hoping I get a chance to get at them tomorrow because I think I figured them out a little bit late. But uh, cloud cloud cover and wind, I need it tomorrow, and it's that's what we're gonna have. Well, we see, we'll see how it works out for you, Zeke. Anybody want to thank real quick? Yeah. Uh, I want to thank my dad for driving down. I actually got my uh, window broken out. Uh, well, he got it fixed, but I uh, want to thank Bass for treating us like royalty, and uh, and y'all just do an awesome job with all these nation events. Well, Zeke, we sure do thank you for that, man, and uh, hope to see you tomorrow. 13-7 today for Zeke, 24-11, two-day total, fifth place currently. Next up, out of Connecticut, Gary Belanger. Gary's got five, had 6-2 yesterday. Let's help him. Gary Belanger got five today. Five today, man. Gary had 6-2 yesterday, five more today. And, man, how, how awesome is it for you to be here on this stage right now? Very awesome, very fortunate. Very, very lucky. Surprised I made it. A little tired. Man, you want to tell them a little bit about your story, Gary? Well, cancer for the third time. Still here. Got to thank my nurses, Meg, Julia, Christine, Evelina. Thank all my doctors, but my nurses. I got the best team of nurses there is. They work around. They're the reason I'm still able to do this. And I got to thank my partner. Awesome. Great guy, great day. And Bass, good job. Man, Gary's beating cancer three times and weighing in eight pounds and 13 ounces right here on this stage. Day number two, all the way up into sixth place on the non-boater side. Two-day total weight for this Connecticut non-boater. 14 pounds and 15 ounces. This next guy, Tommy Waltz out of Vermont. Tommy is bringing us five. One five yesterday. A lot better day today. Yeah, I guess you could say that. Way better. A lot better day. Unfortunately, though, probably not going to be quite enough. Oh, no. Yeah, I mean, I was pretty bummed yesterday, but perspective, I got to spend a week with I got four uncles and my aunt, you know, they came from Florida, Long Island, one flew in from Jersey. Uh, so I'm a pretty lucky guy when you can just have your family here, hang out for a few days. My best friend, Jake, we fished Lanier last week. Uh, so, yeah, I, it was a good week for me. Man, you got the whole crew here, and you got eight pounds, 12 ounces a day, 10, one, two-day total. Yep. Yeah, and a quick shout-out, obviously, to my, uh, to my wife uh, holding down the fort with the kids, uh, Vermont Bass Nation, and you guys. You guys did an awesome job. This is a lot of fun. I wish I uh, – had gotten into it a few years ago. Uh, it's it's great to be here, and I, I, had, a, I had, a, had a good time. Well, Tommy, thank you, man. Safe travels back home. 10-1, two-day total for that Vermont boater. Non-boater. Out of New Hampshire, Eric Moulton. Eric's bringing us three. Had two pounds and ten ounces yesterday. Eric, two ten yesterday, three more today. Going to be a little short this week, but uh, wow, man. Awesome job getting to this stage. Yeah, it's been a, been a tough week, but it's been a lot of fun being here. Really, really happy to have made it down here. Um, enjoyed all of it, and we'll give it. Give it a chance next time. Maybe see if we'll make it back here again. But Well, Eric, man, I hope to see you back. And uh, any quick thank yous? Yeah, I just want to say hi to my wife, Jen, back at home, and my, my youngest one, Tanner, uh, my oldest one, Cole, down here at Lander University and the uh, Lander, Lander uh, Bearcats fishing team. So, Well, that's awesome, man. Cole down there with uh, Drew Pridgen as his coach. And uh, down there at Lander University, man, so I know, I mean, it's kind of cool to be right here. Yep, I'm, he's probably out there in the crowd. Uh, or, is he do, or is he doing schoolwork? He tells me he's doing schoolwork, but he's probably on a lake somewhere. But. 
Well, Eric, thank you, man, and I appreciate having you here. Let's get this next guy up here all the way from Mexico, Jorge Trapero Barraza. Two pounds, 11 ounces yesterday. Two eleven yesterday. Anybody you'd like to say hello to back home in Mexico? Los saludos a mi familia, hijos, esposa, y a todos los amigos que nos apoyan. Five pounds even today, Jorge. Yeah, you know. Five pounds even today, all the way from Mexico. Two day total, seven pounds eleven ounces for Jorge Barraza. Jorge, thank you for fishing with us, man, and I know I'll see you again. Thank you. 7-11, 7-11. Man, you see the number on that boat? Getting smaller. Getting smaller. Well, that means there's six left. Yeah, I don't know if the heaviest code is weighed yet, though, and that's what got me nervous. Uh-oh. He says the day one leader is not weighed across this stage, and I can tell you he hasn't come across this stage. But let's get this next non-boater up. Out of Illinois, Alex Ellerbrock. Alex had two six yesterday, three to go with it today. Any any hellos and thank yous for you, Alex? Yeah, so I have three people that I want to shout out. One is here somewhere. Uh, is Mike Toe? He's our president. Uh, oh, right on. He's right there. Right on. Uh, and then uh, Matt Marquis. He's uh he's my club president back home. And then somebody very special is uh Frank Lebanowski. Back home, he used to run juniors. Uh, he's still around. So anybody that's from IBN, they know him. So those are my three guys I'd like to say thank you to. So that's, that's about it. Alex, 414 for you today. Two-day total, th seven pounds and four ounces. Seven, four for you. This next guy took home the win. At our northern regional at Lake Winnebago, Josh Wiesner. Had 13 pounds and 8 ounces yesterday. And another good bag for Josh today. 13, 8 to start the day. Said he didn't weigh him. He wasn't quite sure what he had. Looking for 13, 12 to take the lead. 13 pounds, 12 ounces, Josh Wiesner into first place on the boater's side. Two-day total, 27 pounds and 4 ounces. Josh Wiesner into first place on the boater's side, 27 pounds and four ounces, and man, wow, right on the button right there. How'd you know that? You know, <laughs> shaking a little bit. That'll get you excited, won't it? Normally, I'm weighing them as they come in, but I had so many dinks today. I just threw them in the live well and uh, finally upgraded as the day went on, but I didn't think I had that much. I was hoping for 13, but we'll take 13, 12. Well, Josh, looks like I'll be talking to you again tomorrow. First place out of Wisconsin. See you tomorrow, Josh Wiesner. Next up, out of Wisconsin, Brian Schumacher. Brian had 6'10 yesterday. Look at those he's holding up, man. Tough day for you, Brian. And, man, just tough day, but wow. Yeah, it was a tough day. This was an awesome experience. Um, we just we were around fish, but uh, just couldn't catch them. I had one bite today, and the fish was as long as my hand. So, yeah, uh, thank you to my family back home, friends watching, and thank you, babe, for coming to support me. Well, Brian, good luck getting back home. Safe travels, man. Next up. Your Central Regional Champion, 
out of Missouri, Cole Finley. Cole had 11 pounds, 15 ounces yesterday. 11, 15 yesterday. 11, 15 yesterday. A little bit better day today, he says. To get inside the cut, he's looking for 11 pounds and 6 ounces. No, 9-2 for the cut. 9-2 for the cut. 13 pounds, 7 ounces. All the way up to 6th place for Cole Finley. 25 pounds and 6 ounces. Cole Finley, 6th place, 25 pounds and 6 ounce, 2 day total. Cole, 13-7 today, great day, great upgrade. Again, up in that weight every day and consistency here at Lake Harbor is what's going to get you on to tomorrow. And, man, we're going to see how it shakes out. I believe there's four left, isn't that right? So, it, you know. We'll be fishing tomorrow, I'm pretty sure of that, so. I need to catch more tomorrow, though, to have a chance to win. Well, let's see if you can do it, Cole. I look forward to seeing you again. Any quick thank yous? Yeah, I want to say hi to Asher, Hagen, and Cooper, my three little kids, and my wife. So. Well, hello back home. And, uh, man, thank you. Thank you, Cole. 25-6, Cole Finley out of Missouri. And this guy coming up here next. Was your day number one leader on the non-voter side out of New Mexico, Cole Boozer. Cole's bringing us two fish today. Two fish today for Cole. Two fish, Cole. You need five pounds an ounce. They got to be very big ones. I think I need about three more for that. Let's see what we can get you on this weight right here, Cole. One pound, eight ounces for you, Cole. Got you in seventh place, though, currently. And, wow, what a week. Seventh place, non-boater here at the Nation Championship. Yeah, yesterday was just phenomenal. Um, pretty unreal. Today was just, it was just a struggle. I've been talking with Will Davis each day, and we just keep going back and forth saying, if it's your time, it's your time. And, just wasn't my time, but uh, hats off to all the guys catching them. It's not easy out there. That's all I'll say. Um, but, yeah, I'd love to be back in the next couple years. Well, man, I'll see you back, Cole, and uh, thank you for. I'd like to say hi to my wife back home, Sienna, and my family. My parents made it out. Um, thank you, everybody. I really appreciate you. Thank you, Cole. Give Cole Boozer a, a huge round of applause. He was your day number one leader. Next up. The winner of our Western Regional, Mr. Sean Andrichick. Sean's got five for us today, 5'10 yesterday. Sean, better day it looks like a little bit. How about nine pounds, two ounces for you, but uh, didn't quite get on him this week. No, 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 we didn't, but I had a great time. I got to fish a lake that I only seen on TV. So it, it was a good time. I, I have to thank uh, my two boys. Uh, they're watching right now. They're my biggest fans, uh, Taryn and Taylor. Um, yeah, it, it was a good time. It, it, we don't get out back east here much, so it was an experience. So maybe someday we'll get back here again. Well, Sean, man, I sure do appreciate you fishing with us and get back home to those two boys. 9-2 today. 9 pounds, 2 ounces for Sean today. Two-day total, 14 pounds, 12 ounces. Coming on up here, non-boater out of Mississippi, had 6.15 yesterday. Tristan Geriga had 6.15 yesterday. A much better day for Tristan today. 6.15 yesterday. Nine pounds, 12 ounces, Tristan Geriga. All the way up to third place on the non-boater side.
Tristan Garriga, two-day total, 16 pounds and 11 ounces. Man, Tristan, really good bag on day number two here at the Bass Nation Championship, and this uh, got you sitting in third place currently, man, and, uh, man, that's awesome. Yeah, man, I couldn't ask for more. I told myself when I came up here I wanted to be in the top ten, and I feel like I accomplished that. And I missed one fish today that might would have put me on up there, but it happens. It's fishing, so. Yeah, that is fishing, unfortunately. Anybody you would like to say hello or thank you to? I'd like to say hello to my fiance. She's out there somewhere, and everybody watching back at the house. Thank you all. Well, Tristan, we sure do thank you. 16-11, two-day total. It's got Tristan in third place on the non-boater side. This next guy out of Delaware is your, uh-oh, look out. He's digging down in that weigh-in bag. Brian LeClaire, your 2023 Nor Northeastern Regional Champion, Brian LeClaire. Brian LeClaire. Brian LeClaire had 10 pounds, 9 ounces to start the day. Looking for 11-3 to get inside that cut. Yeah, I think, I'll, I think I might hit that mark. He says he thinks he might hit that mark. Yeah, I think he's going to hit that mark. 15 pounds, 8 ounces. Brian LeClaire jumps all the way up into 6th place. On the boater side, sixth place on the boater side. And it is going to be a shootout tomorrow on day number three at Lake Hartwell. Brian LeClaire. Brian LeClaire, 15 pounds and 8 ounces, and he's going to weigh this one for Big Bass. Yeah, 314, 314, going to be a little short. But, Brian, man, has Lake Hartwell treated you good this year or what? Yeah, it is. I had a good day today. Everything worked out. My co-angler got him. He didn't catch the big ones, though. I got him today. <laughs> Brian got the big one today. His, his co-angler got him yesterday. 26 pounds in an ounce, sixth place currently. And, uh, man, we're going. I'm going to see you in the morning. Yeah, I'm, I'm, going, I'm good for it. Yeah. Well, me too. Well, I'll see you in the morning, Brian, and thank you. Next up, coming out of Virginia, Kevin Walton and Hayden. One, what does that say, two? So that means there is one guy left between you and and that trophy. That last guy I'm a little worried about. That last guy there. He did good the first day. He sure did do good the first day. So I'm worried. Well, we'll see here after we get Mr. Kevin Walton out of Virginia Wade, our southern regional champion, Kevin Walton. He had 10-15 yesterday. And, Kevin, you got me five more today. How about 8.14 for you, Kevin? 8.14 and going to fall a little bit short this week. Weight's really tight here on day number two at Lake Hartwell. Got you in 25th. But, man, you took home the trophy back at the Southern Regional, and you get to be here on this stage. 25th place, man. Great year for you. Yeah, like you said, I got to be here. Uh, this is what I wanted to do at the start of this year, make this tournament. This is uh, a dream come true for me. I just couldn't get to meet that frog this week, you know. Just couldn't get it to happen and uh, repeat it, but uh, – I was just glad to make it here. I got my wife here again, my kids here. I mean, that makes me a winner. I get to go home with her, most amazing woman in the world. I got my mother and father-in-law here. I got a ton of people watching back home. I just got to say thank you to everybody. I got one of the biggest support systems I mean, I could ever ask for on this level, and uh, I just got a lot of support, so I, I love it. Well, Kevin, man, it was great meeting you, man, and uh, I hope to see you again. Absolutely, and uh, everybody, another round of applause for him. He does a great job all week with us, treated us like superstars. And, uh, again, I just want to shake your hand. Man, thank you, Kevin. That means the world, dude. Thank you so much. 814 for Kevin Walton. 1913. There is one guy left, Hayden. One co-angle left. And we're going to weigh Will Davis first, so we're going to weigh you last. You're killing me, man. You're killing me. I am? You are. <laughs> Go 
killing me, man. It's killing me. Well, man, how awesome would it be to take that thing home? Like I said, it'd be a blessing, and I, I, all I hope for. All right, Hayden. Let's go ahead and roll him on up here. Mr. Will Davis, Jr., you're defending Bass Nation champion from Lake Pickwick in 2022 and the 2023 Bassmaster Elite Series champion. Will Davis Jr. had 16 pounds and an ounce to start the day. And he's got five more for us today. Will Davis had 16-1 yesterday. And I'm going to be honest, I don't even have to see the weight on these. You're going to be with me tomorrow. Uh, yeah, I hope so. Um, you know, it's tough today. I mean, I only had eight bites and, and caught six of them. So I hope I can do it again tomorrow. Well, let's get these babies locked in and make this thing official. 14 pounds, 4 ounces, Will Davis Jr. all the way to the top of the leaderboard. 30 pounds and 5 ounces, Will Davis Jr. rockets into the lead right here at the 2023 Bass Nation Championship. Looking to defend his title from last year. 30 pounds and 5 ounces, 30 pounds and 5 ounces, and Will I'm going to talk to you tomorrow, man. Let's get these co angers up here, man. How how awesome is this? It's, uh, it's incredible. Thank all of y'all for coming out. Well, man, I'll see you tomorrow. Will Davis, your day two leader, 30 pounds and five ounces. Mr. Larry Witt's about to come up here. Larry, come on up here. Hold, hold, leave them fish in that bag right there, Larry. Let me come talk to you first for just a second. Don't run off with that truck. Uh, Larry might be go chasing down through the parking lot. He says this old man might have to get in second gear after that bag of fish. Yeah, man, it's a that bag of fish right there. I'm telling you, I had to fight the man for that. You get behind that guy who just walked off this stage fishing, and you catch a fish behind him, you have done something. I am not kidding you. That was the toughest guy I have ever fished behind in my whole life. And I've been behind some good ones. But um, it's just one of those days you catch them or you don't catch them. When you get a good bag, you know it. And when it's your day, you know it. So. Well, Larry, you got 11-11. Anybody wants to say hello or thank you too, man, no matter how this shakes out, man, an awesome week for you. I've got to see you two years in a row, man. And, uh, golly, it's just so awesome. Well, it was, it was great, man. You guys do a fantastic job. Bass has always took care of us uh, 100% when we come to these things. And it just don't get any better than this. Just don't get any better. Uh, it's a lot of people. Uh, Big M back home. Hey, guys. Good to see you all. Uh, thanks for all the calls. Hey, uh. Thank uh, Region 2. My wife's up here somewhere. I don't know exactly where she is. If it wasn't for her, I probably wouldn't be here. So, <laughs> But uh, we got it going on. I I know that uh, this man right here is waiting to get out of that seat. So let's get going with it. All right, Will. All right, Larry, go get it. Hayden, come on up here. One of these two guys is going to be walking home with that trophy right there. Larry Witt had 11-11 to start the day. Need six pounds and six ounces to take over the lead. Six pounds, six ounces for Larry Witt. And if not, Hayden Spradling is your 2023 Bass Nation non-boater champion. Go ahead and shake hands, guys, and let's see how this will turn out. Larry, you're looking for 6'6". Six, six. Hayden wants anything less than that. Four pounds, six ounces. Hayden Spradling is your 2023 TNT Fireworks Bass Nation non voter champion. Grab that trophy, Aiden. Go ahead and hold it up high.
Hayden Spradling with 18 pounds. Even give him a big round of applause. He's going to be fishing tomorrow as a boater. Looking to chase them down for three. Bassmaster Classic Burst Man. Lewis Pee Wee Powers Memorial Trophy. Non-boater champion at the nation championship. Undescribable. It's unreal. That's all I got to say. It's unreal. I'm lost for words right now. It's been such an absolute grind out here and just had to keep my head in it all all the days. Even practice was tough, but put my head down and just fished hard and made it happen. Well, Hayden, let's go ahead and get you right up there one more time. Hold it up really big, really high. Let's give him a big round of applause, everyone. 18 pounds even. 2023 TNT Fireworks Bass Nation Championship Non-Boater Champion Aiden Spradling. All right, ladies and gentlemen, don't go anywhere. We are going to call our top 10 that will be competing tomorrow up here. Hayden, great job, and, uh, and you are going to be included in that as an 11th place, 11th boater right here on the non-boater side. They make the jump tomorrow for a shot at three Bassmaster Classic bursts and an Elite Series burst. Hayden Spradling.